How about, how about instead of, wait, hold on. How about, how about, how about instead of going to eight, we play Crisis Core? What about that? What about that? What about that? Morgan cosplay. Yeah, it's Morgan from um, Darkstalkers. From Darkstalkers. Need more FF stuff? Do I? Do I? <laughs> Do I need Crisis Core remake later this year? But what about the OG? What if we played the OG? Hi, Flora. How are you, Flora? Exactly, Scotty. I want to play nine. I'm waiting for the explanation, Willis. Where is it? I'm waiting. Did I take many pictures? I took some, but I need to take more. I need to take more. Yes, there's never enough. Okay, that's a good point. Hi, Omega. By the way, how are you? Thank you for thinking I look amazing. I have to I have to have my mom adjust the, the bodice a bit because it doesn't really fit me perfectly. So I want it to be adjusted so that I can wear it without wearing stuff like underneath it. Where's Sean? Sean's over in bed. He's over there. Sometimes he appears on Activating stream though. Combat mode. Monster, thank you for the sub at tier two. Tier two for 23 months, almost two years. Hi, Margu. Hello. Hi, AA Ron. How are we doing? -na 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 -na. We are in combat mode now. -na 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 -na. But thank you for almost two full years. Two full years of subbing at tier two. That's wild. Thank you so much, Jump Monster. Up. Thank you so, so much. I'm honestly so happy that I can do like these early streams for like monster and obviously puzzles, although I know puzzle sleep schedule is wild, but it's just nice. Twitch be like 18 months rip puzzles, I'm sorry. Big fan, I'm a big fan of you. I'm a big fan of all of you. How are y'all doing? Uh, so you feel like Jin may get an enlightened experience, something recognized in 9 from 4? I feel like 9 has a lot of references to a lot of the Final Fantasies that came before it. Because I feel like it's exactly what Sin said, yeah. 9 is loaded with a lot of references to the games before it. It's supposed to be like a return to like OG FF after like 8 and 7 and such. So I feel like that makes sense. That makes sense. Thank you, Willis, for loving the cosplay. Hi, B. How are you? Hi, Quizzy. Well, it won't be as wild anymore because you're working again. That's true, Puzzles. You have to get back to work. Although I know you're really happy about going back to work. I will agree with what Plume said earlier, by the way, in response to, to Sins. I do think it's great to have that attitude. I wish I had that attitude when things were going rough for me. But usually when things are rough for me, I don't have that attitude until later. <laughs> I'm a crybaby. <laughs> How's everybody doing? How's your Sundays? Not anymore. Not anymore. You don't want to go back. Time to take a break again. Let's take let's take another four week break. Although you you go on vacation in like less than a month, so at least there's that. Hi, hunk solo. How are you? You can't wait to get back into Final Fantasy IX. Please give it another chance. It's so good. It's so good. FF9 was a love letter. It was, and it was the perfect love letter because it's the goddamn best. It's the best. I still need to play 4, though, Willis. That's on my list. I have it on my PSP, actually. Um, or not my PSP, my PS Vita. So we'll play it. We all hope. They, all they said was this winter, so it could drop in January. I feel like it would have to be January or February if it's going to be then. Because why would they say this winter if it wasn't going to be soonish? I don't know. They could also push it to March, March and make me sad. You're doing good just having a lazy Sunday as usual. Same, except for the cosplay. Except for the cosplay. <laughs> the cosplay makes me not lazy. Hi, JJ. How are you? Thank you for loving the Morgan cosplay. I appreciate y'all. I'm glad to hear that most people are doing well. That's always good. Um, I feel like Final Fantasy IX, if I had played it as a kid, I probably would have gotten lost and I would not have been able to like beat it. So I'm glad that I played it as an adult. You haven't played four or six, so there's that. Ooh, ooh. You're telling Jin to play four, but you haven't played four? Interesting. Interesting, Willis. Why do you betray me so? <laughs> Anyways, I think Jin should play nine next. All those in favor say aye. I I'm just kidding. <laughs> I don't want to pressure Jin. Jin, play eight. I hope you enjoy it. The only thing is, is I haven't played eight, so I'm going to have to, like, avoid. I'm going to have to avoid it because I haven't played it. I can watch the beginning. Actually, you know what? Maybe I don't have to avoid it because I watched Megan do the ending of Final Fantasy VIII and I understood jack shit nothing. So I possibly can watch it without being, 
spoiled on anything. Because watching the ending of Final Fantasy VIII, I was like, I have no idea what's going on. Is this what LSD feels like? So I don't know. I, I don't know. Maybe I can. <laughs> Maybe I can watch it. AI. We'll play AI uh, next week. Next Sunday, we're going to be playing I, the Somnium Files. Hi, Entropic. How are you? Isn't Final Fantasy IX getting an animated series? It's supposed to be. They announced it and they showed it at some conference in Las Vegas, but we haven't seen anything from it. So I guess we'll have to see. In order, at least, please. Fair. It's valid. It's valid. AI, the Somnium Files. Yeah. We'll play it. We'll play it soon. I promise. Happy Sunday, Pack. How are you? I don't think I will ever understand A even when I play it. I think it's going to mess up my brain. Like watching Megan play the ending, I had no idea what was going on and I was so confused. But you know what? It's kind of worth it. Also, I just realized I selected the wrong scene. This is what we want to be. I'm so confused on where you are in chat. I am all over the place. Flying to New York on the 28th. Yeah, but you won't be, uh, so yeah, less than a month. Less than a month. Because you won't be in California until August. So you'll have time off from work again. Hi, Galay, how are you? I do jump around, because sometimes I read messages at the bottom and then I realize I miss messages at the top, so I have to like go back up. I realize I miss messages later sometimes. Hello, wait, hello, fuck, is your name fucker guy? <laughs> hello, what a username. What a username. Your mom named you? Your mom named you fucker? Your mom has impeccable taste. What a name. What a name. What a name. That's fantastic. Hi, Sky. How are you? Hi, Beast Days. It's the PSTV. It is the PSTV, correct. How are you doing? I do be jumping around. I'm everywhere at once. Every Anywhere, everywhere, all at once. Everywhere, anywhere, all at once. I forget the name of the movie. I'm that. I hardly know her guy. It's true. That was fantastic. I, I saw it and I was like, wait, the way that I would say that is fucker guy. Fantastic. Fantastic. I have a P I have a PS Vita too. My Vita's right here, actually. It's got a little Kirby keychain. But I'd be playing on my TV so that I can stream it. Legend of Mana's getting an animated series? Wait, what? Parasite Eve is so great. The book is so interesting. I've been told to read the book. I haven't I haven't uh, read the book though. I should, because I feel like it would explain a lot and help me understand what's going on. <laughs> uh, that's awesome. It is awesome. I agree. I agree. New York in a half uh, and a half and Cali in two and a half weeks. So yeah, you'll have time off again soon, Puzzles. That's good at least. Sky, how are you doing? Thank you for liking my Morgan cosplay. I love you. I hope you're well. I love all y'all, y'all are the best. I'm a cosplay queen, thank you so much. How interesting is it? Interesting. Interesting? So interesting. Do I know any other word in Tropic? The answer is no. No, I do not. <laughs> uh, you have the first Vita model? I do not have the first Vita model, I don't think. I think the one that I have is the second one? Yeah, the second one. No, you're the best, no, you! You guys are the best. You guys are the best. Gintristing, well said. Rebrand to Gintristing. Let's go. Yeah, PS Vita 2000. That's the one that I have. Uh, Darkstalkers is a fighting game, correct? If I'm Morgan, can Sean be Lilith? Sean, would you like to be Lilith? <laughs> I don't think he would. There were two Vita models. There were. That's how you know that they didn't advertise it well because people don't even realize there were two models. That says a lot. Okay. Okay. <laughs> F that save. Look at that evil save that just haunts me. Haunts my dreams and my nightmares. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, much appreciated. I do have anonymous follows on just cause I don't like calling people out of lurk. If you do want to introduce yourself, please feel free. We're friendly people, a little chaotic, but we're friendly. And if you would rather stay lurking, that is okay too. We appreciate lurkers here as well. Let me turn off the music. And I also gotta, I just remembered, I gotta put this on my, monitor you're pretty scary we're all spooky we're all spooky did i know the psp has three models it has three wait what are the three models or five models of the psp you've probably seen morgan and marvel versus capcom i've never played more Mar Mar i've never played marvel versus capcom ever i've only played like dark stalkers that she's been in 
Um, I don't know. Don't ask me how I played Darkstalkers, but I did. I hope today is a good day for you too, Sky. I'm so behind on chat. I missed so many messages. Yeah, apparently a lot of JRPGs are getting series, which is kind of nice. I hope that that means that they're going to like either remake or port more uh, RPGs so people can play them. <laughs> Wait a minute. Margie, what that mean? What about Dimitri? That's a good point. I don't know if Sean would ever cosplay with me. He's not really into cosplaying himself. Um, he helps me with my cosplay, though. So, like, he helped me put on the wings and take pictures. Four PSP models, 1,000, 2,000, 3,000 in the go. Oh, okay, interesting. That's fascinating. I wonder which PSP models I have. Because I have my sister's old PSP, I have my pink PSP, and I have a new PSP that I could show on stream today, but I haven't, I haven't shown. Um, hi, Jangshi, love your cosplay. Thank you, Dick Grayson's Tushy. I appreciate it. Do you mind if I call you Tushy? Can I just call you Tushy? I love calling you Tushy. <laughs> I think it's a perfect nickname. I think it is. Oh, hey, apparently Darkstalkers is old. It's an old game and they haven't really made a lot of new ones. I'm glad that people like the cosplay because I was really self-conscious about it and Sean had to like reassure me when I was putting it on. Anyone remember the PSP Street? I do not. Blit. Blit. Do I ever play Guilty Gear? I have not. I have not played Guilty Gear, but I've heard I might like it. PSP Street is a new one. I've never heard of it. It's like a mini PSP, but without the UMD drive. Ah, oh, that's fascinating. Okay. Elise behind on chat. What is the sorcery? Uh, a mode. lot. Derpy! Thank you for the sub, Derpy. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Sheesh. Thank you, Derpy. I'm really behind on chat, but I appreciate the sub. Ba -na 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 -na. We're in combat mode now. Ba -da 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 -da. What got me into cosplay? Um... I have always admired cosplayers from afar. Like I've always thought cosplay Jeez. was an interesting uh, hobby. I just never thought that I could do it myself because I was very insecure and like not very confident in my appearance or that I could look like the characters or that I could do it. And it was actually both Stephanie Stone and uh, Vampy Bit Me Linda. Um, so both Steph and Linda really encouraged me to just try it out and see if I liked it. Um, and every time I would bring up wanting to cosplay a character, they were like, you should do it, you should do it. So inevitably I just tried it and I ended up falling in love with it and wanting to do it all the time. <laughs> so that is how I ended up getting into cosplay and why I continue to do it. It's just become a very like, uh, it's a hobby that I'm very passionate about at this point. I just really like it. I've never done it in person though. I've only done it on streams and like for pictures. I've never, I've never done like a cosplay at an event because I started in quarantine. So I started in 2020. Let's just hope they are better than live action adaptations. Hopefully they are. I can't imagine that they'd be worse. How are you doing, Derby, by the way? I can call you Toshi. Yes, my dream has come true. This is the best. I'm so excited. Um, I'm hoping they're using the money they got from 14 for some cool projects. I think they will. It seems like Square is like all about doing some cool shit. Like Harvestella looks neat too. You played Soul Calibur as a kid, but the later games really mowed your meadow because they were recycled and light on content. I only played Soul Calibur 2, but I really liked it. And the reason I played it was because Link was in it. I'm behind on chat, so I see you guys all talking down below. I promise I will get to you. <laughs> Since the PSP store shut down, it would be worthless. Oh, then no. I don't want PSP Street ever. It would be cool to like if you were collecting those things to have it. It's none of them? Rip Doc, we need to get you a PSP. They're so cool. Although the online store isn't a thing anymore, so maybe it's not worth it. Maybe it's not worth it. Hi, Human Abstraction. How are you? We're talking about the... You're talking about the PSP Go? Wait, then what's PSP Street? Lagaya, I love you. Thank you for loving my cosplay. Hello. Yes, it is a high Q sound command. I have two of them. I have Hey, Hey, Hey from Bakudo and then Oya oh, Oya. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. I'm a big high Q fan. I really like Haikyuu. Final Fantasy VII music, you can't appreciate even more. Well, yeah, because it's Crisis Core Final Fantasy VII, duh. See, Jin, you should just play Crisis Core because then you can continue your Final Fantasy VII journey and it's like it's not over. I've never really played a lot of hack and slash games either. I've been told to play God of, God of War though in Tropic and I never have. Hi, MQ, how are you? Good to see you. Thank you for loving my cosplay. I am really happy that you guys like this cosplay a lot. 
Imagine a 2D fighter, but the pace and aesthetic of the fighters, the soundtrack is heavily inspired by heavy metal music. I find it hard to imagine a 2D fighter other than Skullgirls. Does that count as 2D or is that 3D? I don't know. But I like Skullgirls a lot, so maybe I'd like it. It's been years since you've cosplayed. Let's cosplay, Whoa! Sky. Let's do it. Limited edition. Limited edition. Thank you for the limited edition. It's awesome. I think it's common to have that initial fear, but everyone I know who cosplays loves it after they try it once. I think everyone is just afraid to do it. One, because a lot of people like make fun of people who do it, which I don't get why. It's basically like having Halloween year round and it's awesome. Um, but I also just think like it's very nerve wracking because you have to feel like, I don't want to say you have to be confident because you don't because I'm still not a confident person. But I do think it's one of those things where it's like you have to like break out of your shell and just try it once to get into it. And that's like a hard obstacle to overcome because I feel like if you're not like super confident, you end up talking yourself out of it a lot. Like you make excuses to be like, no, no, it's too hard to make this. It's too hard to get this wig. You know what I mean? So like it is a very like hard thing to do but I feel like most people once they try it if it was something that they were interested in trying it they usually love it and then they can't stop how is monster on her eyes last night I missed you on that one no worries MQ I hope you had fun with the community games that you, that you did do um they were fun the hunts went really well I just need to grind some gear on PC because I keep dying I get one shot by things and that's not good I'm doing well, Derpy. Today's my first day off. It's the start of my weekend, so I'm just chilling. I'm having a good time catching up with everybody. I promise we will get I am moving soon. <laughs> I, we will get I am moving soon. Uh, you meant the PSP Street is the PSP 1000, but without Wi-Fi? Oh, okay. Interesting. Interesting. If you haven't... Oh, wait. Nira, we're talking about... Just play Crisis Core for the rest of the year? Yes, play it forever. You have Dirge, too. You have Dirge of Cerberus. Dirge of Cerberus and um, Crisis Core. So you've got some Final Fantasy stuff left. And you've got Advent Children. You can watch the Advent Children movie. Hi, beautiful Eric. How are you? Thank you for liking my cosplay. Welcome in. Uh, you just finished watching Free and was thinking about starting Haikyuu. Please watch Haikyuu. It's so cute and it's so funny. I absolutely love it. Also, wait, Sky, what cosplays have you done? I want to know now. I hope that you're doing well. I hope everyone's doing well. You'd consider the KH series a hack and slash FF7R, kind of? I guess. I don't really know what constitutes a hack and slash versus just an action RPG. Hi, Ghoulicious. How are you? It's not about confidence. It's about swallowing. Okay, boss. Interesting. Interesting take. Interesting take. 2D fighter just means not 3D in the terms of the stage, whereas... Oh, okay. So, yeah. Skullgirls is 2D. Noted. You called the PSP Street the PSP Mini. There it is. Nice. Why do my cosplays always turn out so good? I don't know, Chief. I kind of just wing it. I don't, I don't really like, I don't know how to explain it. Like, I just, I enjoy it a lot and I care a lot about how they look, I guess. Like, I'm very picky. Um, <laughs> if a cosplay doesn't turn out how I like it, I end up feeling super self-conscious. But yeah, I think I'm just very picky. But thank you, Chief. I'm glad that you like it. I still am very nitpicky about this cosplay. Like, I want to fix the bangs. So I plan on fixing the bangs at some point. Um, and I still got to hit up... Uh, I got to hit up Jill to do cosplays together. We got to do that. Hi, Funkers. How are you doing today? Also, thank you, Beast Days. Thank you, thank you. I'm the protagonist of a cosplay anime. I am Marin Kitagawa. Everyone said when Dress Up Darling came out that I was Marin Kitagawa. Um, we've had the same hair at some point. We act the same way, apparently. Like, everyone when we were watching the anime was just like, this is Elise, this is Elise. When we were watching it in Discord, and I'm like, okay, I've accepted my fate. Which I need to do another cosplay of her at some point. She was really cute. Um, but I do, I do want to show... Um, I did want to show something. Hold on. I gotta, like, back up a ton. <laughs> I gotta back up a ton. Hold on. Why is it so far back here? I can't bend over. It's too hard. Sean? Oh, you're sleeping. Never mind. I'm gonna try to pick this up. This is very difficult. This is very difficult. A secret slime? No, I don't have any new slimes. It's not a new slime. Hold on. This is like so hard. Okay. Okay. 
I got it. I got it. All right. I got it. Okay. All right. Carisi was deaf your fave. Oh, I haven't. I haven't seen uh, Steins Gate. I would really like to watch the anime and play the visual novel. Um, but that's really cool. If you do a GG cosplay, you really are Marin. I could. I could do one. It's a crisis core thing. Yeah. I told y'all how I was like, um, <laughs> remember, am I glued to my chair? Yes. Yes, I am. I don't like getting up if I don't have to. Um, also, hi. Hi, number. Hello. I did buy it. Yes. I had it in my cart and they offered me another discount and I ended up buying it for the discounted price because it was super discounted and not very expensive. Um, and it came in like a few days. Uh, but I will show, I will show, it didn't come with the Buster Sword keychain, so they're also going to be giving me a partial refund, which is cool, so it ended up be even being uh, cheaper than I thought. <laughs> it's even cheaper than I thought. Um, I'm a little bummed. In a shoe box, it's the official box, see it says Crisis Core? Crisis Core Final Fantasy VII on the side. It's the official box that it came in. It would be more cool, though. It would be, but it's okay. Am I excited for the remake? I am. I've heard it's a remaster, though. Like, it's officially a remaster, not a remake, so that makes me happy. The streamer chair. Yeah, every streamer is glued to their chair. But, Sky, that's really cool. Do you have, like, any of your cosplays posted? <laughs> You've done Ryzen from To- I've never seen Tohu, or is it a game? It might be a game. Cherry Blossom Hatsune Miku, that's so cute. Wait, that's so cute. It does suck about the Buster Sword, and I was hoping maybe they'd offer to send me it separately, but they didn't. So I was just like, okay. But um, this is the back of the PSP. It's got Zack, it's got Cloud, it's got Sephiroth. And it says uh, Final Fantasy VII 10th Anniversary on the side. Do, do, do. The only things that I'm missing from like my Crisis Core collection at this point are uh, are um, the Loveless pendant and then the thing that um, Plume brought up that came with it when you pre-ordered the game initially. It also came with uh, headphones. It also has headphones. Final Fantasy VII 10th Anniversary. It's going to be prettier, and apparently they've improved some of the, like, combat and stuff. But there's the headphones. You can't see, but they also have, like, Zack and uh, Cloud and everybody on it. But it's very cool. I'm still happy with what I got. Like, I think I, at least I got the PSP. I would have been more upset if I got the Buster Sword keychain, but not the PSP. Uh, it's a PSP 2000 for the person who asked the model. It's the 2000 model. I'm going to put this up here for now, I think. Yeah, I'm going to put that up there. And then I'll repackage it up later. But there you go. That's that's what I wanted to show. I had I hadn't shown it. Um the design on the side of the box is really cool too. It's the same like design. It's really nice. I just like collecting stuff for my favorite games. That box is now on the floor, but I'll I'll pick it up later. Your Twitter profile pic is that you need to change is of uh, Elaine, but I don't think I have pics floating around of the others. I would love to see them. It's as pretty as the Final Fantasy VII remake. It is. 25 years ago? Please, I'm going to feel old. I'm going to feel old. But it is very nice. I'm really happy with it. Um, I will look for, like, a Buster Sword keychain, but it's not really, like, a bummer if I don't get it, you know? Like, it's okay. If I end up not having it, I'd rather, I'd rather not have it. What's in here? Mo plus 30. Okay. Let's see. You just need to cosplay again sometime. Quarantine kind of killed that hobby. It's funny, though, because for me, it birthed the hobby. Like, quarantine brought that hobby into, like, full swing for me. Um, I really, really love cosplaying from home. I know cosplaying at events is, like, a huge deal, and most people like that. But I... <laughs> I really love cosplaying in my own house, y'all. It makes me so happy. I can just stay at home and be lazy, and I get to just vibe with everybody. It's a jam. Um, Can I, like, discard items or no? 
I kind of want to like discard some stuff. Oh, I can. Yeah, get rid of that. I don't care about that. Uh, cures darkness, which I will probably need in here. I don't know if I'm going to need this, so I'm just going to get rid of some stuff. Okay, let's let's continue on. Quarantine cosplay is just a small home Halloween party. It's true. It kind of is. I don't think I want to go this way. I think I need to try to find healing items. I remember last time. So for those who weren't here last time, last time I like soft locked myself into a warehouse. And so now we're basically just trying to find our way um, through the sewer. <laughs> Once again, bragging about being a cave gremlin. It's worth it. You love the special edition consoles? The art is always neato. Yeah, they are really cool. Sometimes they can be a miss, but usually they are really neat. Did I come from this way? Warehouse is cursed. Don't go there. I will not. For reals with cosplay, you never have an idea. You never not have an idea for Halloween costumes. I still don't even know what I'm going to wear for Halloween this year. It'll probably just be a Halloween stream that I do, if I'm being real. Like, that will probably be what I do. And then I'll just wear a cosplay. Might bring back my Mimikyu cosplay. That was cute. How many people in here have played uh, Parasite Eve, by the way? Just so I have, like, an idea. If I need help, remember there's a gun and armor in these sewers. That's very good. Yeah, I'm going to explore. Where <laughs> Warehouse is cursed. I learned the hard way that the warehouse is cursed. Hi, Shu. How are you? But yeah, if you've never cosplayed from home or done like cosplay streams, I highly recommend it. It's just fun. It's a nice way to like do the hobby without having to worry about things. Oh, I have the darkness. Hold on. Oh my goodness. Hi, Kimu. How are you? Hello, hello. Mimikyu you cosplay. I don't think I have any pictures of it, actually. Am I going to get hit by that? Okay, I did get hit by it. There's like, I don't know how I fought this last time. Genuinely, I don't know how I fought this last time. Maybe like that? I don't know. I have no idea. Cure D, but what if you want the D? Then you can get the D on your own terms. You can get the D on your own terms. All right, there we go. Cosplay photo shoots at home are just mad comfy. I wish I was better at it. To be honest, I'm not really good at taking cosplay photos, but I'm happy that I have Sean here to help at least. You know a Mimikyu fan that might be interested in seeing that? I have a clip with it, but I don't know if I have any photos. That was before I started taking, like, a lot of cosplay photos, if I'm being real. Like, I remember I used to take, like, a lot more cosplay photos. Oh, no. I used to not take any cosplay photos when I wore cosplays on stream, but nowadays I wear a lot more. Or not, I wear a lot more. I take a lot more <laughs> photos. My brain is fried, y'all. My brain is fried. You haven't dressed up for Halloween since you were something like 12? I dress up for Halloween, like, every year. It's my favorite holiday. That cosplay was neat. I like my Mimikyu cosplay. I thought it was cute. I have, like, the dress for it still with, like, the hood. I just need, like, the poofy skirt. Hi, Savage! How are you? How are you doing, by the way, Mew? How are you doing, Savage? Can we get a shout-out for Savage? Hi, Nishiyu! Can we also get a shout-out for Nishiyu? How are you? Um... I played the third birthday, but never the other two Parasite Eve games. I've heard they're good. I've heard third birthday is the weakest of the three. Most people like the first one a lot. And then um, I know like a lot of people do not like third birthday. Thank you, Grace. Just chilling on your Sunday off. Yay, let's go. I'm glad that we have Sundays off. We're in this together, Nishiyu. My most popular clip? Yeah, um, I do cosplay often. Usually I cosplay weekly as long as we hit our weekly uh, sub goal. Um, so like every week I have a cosplay sub goal and if we hit the sub goal, I, I cosplay the following week. 
Um, as you can tell, we've hit the sub goal this week, so I'll be wearing a Panty Anarchy cosplay next week from Panty and Stockings Garter Belt. That is what I will be wearing next week on Sunday. It should be fun, but it's always a really good time. I do sometimes do like a lot of uh, random cosplays on days where I'm not usually like planning one for the sub goal, so that may happen. Like eventually, I have to wear my Your Forger cosplay again, which won't be like a sub goal again because. My cosplay stream was cut short because I got a migraine during that one. So I definitely want to bring that one back. Um, let me see where I'm supposed to go here. I feel like I'm going to get lost for sure. Um, hmm. I don't even know where I want to go. Maybe this way? Yeah, I'm definitely going to get lost. I'm definitely going to get lost. I have a map but I'm definitely gonna get lost. It, it was a really cute cosplay, Eric. It was really fun to wear. It's hot though. Like that cosplay generates heat like no other because of the material it's made out of, but it's great. It's a good one. Sunday is for being a lazy little potato. Well said, Mew, well said, it is. Third birthday is okay. Gameplay wise, it's meh. Story wise, it's interesting. I've heard the story though, kind of messes up the characters from like the first two games, which it makes me a little sad. Can I kill this bat in one hit? No, I can't. Can I actually like shoot maybe? Oh my God, these bats are going crazy. Let, let me live, please. Hi, Dave, how are you? Oh, I'm gonna get hit by that, yeah. I truly do wish you could Thank run from you. random encounters. Babic! Thank you for the 300 biddies. Thank you so much, Bavik. Thank you for loving the Morgan cosplay too. It's good to see you. Good luck in the LA heat. Please, please stay hydrated. I hope you're having fun though. It's the circle of life. I wish I was not fat fighting a bat though. Truly, I wish I was not fighting a bat. Oh, I'm gonna get hit by that. No! No! Cosmic Saki! Wait, hold on! Cosmic Saki, thank you for the raid! Thank you so, so much! How was your stream? How is Animal Crossing today? I haven't played New Horizons in so long, but I hope that it was fun. Thank you for loving my little bat wings. <laughs> I actually have like the big wings for the back, but um, I did not wear them while streaming because they would get in the way. Hi, Austin. Hello, is it, is it Saiwuku? I'm not saying that correctly. Please let me know how to say that correctly. It was super chill. I'm glad that it was good. My day's been pretty cool, pretty, pretty good. I was gonna say pretty cool and then I said good and it said, I said pretty good, um, which is not a word. Well, it is a word. That's not the point. The point is, is that I'm, I'm doing very good. Today is my day off um, from work and it's the start of my weekend. So I'm just chilling and I'm having a very good day. I got into cosplay, it went really well. Um, Sean took pictures of me. They turned out great. I'm very happy. <laughs> it's a very good day. Um, but thank you for rating me. Everybody from Cosmic Saki Stream, hello. My name is Elise. I am a variety streamer. I stream a lot of JRPGs for the most part, but I do also play a lot of Monster Hunter, a lot of Soulsborns and Souls Likes, and a lot of visual novels. I am a very chatty streamer, even though I mess up my words a ton. Um, I often get carried away like talking with my community and just vibing with everybody. Um, so if that sounds like your jam, hello, welcome. I hope you enjoy your stay. We're playing Parasite Eve today and I am cosplaying Morgan and it's been a great day. And I just said more again in the worst way possible, but I'm cosplaying Morgan. <laughs> I am not good at talking. Why do I talk a lot when I'm not getting good at talking? Europe is on fire, very literally. Please stay safe, y'all. Please stay safe in the summer. It's crazy. Um, I'm doing good, Dave. How are you doing? You're doing fine. You just said you were doing fine. <laughs> I'm glad that you're doing well, Dave. What have you been up to? Oh, yeah. I do I do not allow backseating unless I say D's nuts, and then you can backseat. But, yeah, welcome in, everybody. Hi, Sleepy Samurai. Hello, Handy Tips. Can we get a shout-out for Handy Tips, please? 
Um, I want to ask, I don't know if you're still here, Cosmic Saki, but do you have a favorite villager in Animal Crossing by any chance? My favorite villager is Static um, and Flurry. Static's been my favorite for many, many years. Oh no. Oh no. I feel like I need to time this better. I definitely need to time this better. Do you really like Nana? Oh, I don't think I've seen Nana. I'm gonna have to look them up. But yeah, it's, I don't know. They're just really, really cute. All the villagers are really cute, but my favorite has to be static. Okay. They're blocking my way to like run around them. Which is really rude. Oh, I'm so dead. This area is stressful. Hi, Illusion. How are you doing today? Replaying RE6 and hunting a, a God of War pre-order. Wait, you're hunting a God of War pre-order? Are you trying to get the collector's edition? I feel like that's not easy. Good luck. No! Oh wait, I got hit, but not by the thing that I thought I got hit by. Now I'm gonna get hit by that. <laughs> no! We did not reset the box, no, none of us know how. And Butter's been busy. Butter's been busy. I do have a bat. I do have a bat in my hair, because I'm a bat lady. Ah! Hold on. You have to go to work now? Good luck at work in Tropic. It was good to see you. I hope the day goes by fast. Okay, this bat is getting all up in my face. I want to look up Nana now. I want to know what type of villager it is. My favorites are always rodents. <laughs> Like hamsters or squirrels or whatever. I love them a lot. But yeah, how are you doing, Illusion? Static sounds like an opposite word. Slow version of Sonic the Hedgehog. Static is a cranky squirrel. He's a cranky squirrel, and I love him. He's just the bee's knees, okay? Please do not hate on Static. He's just a cutie. She's, wait, 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 wait. What did I miss? It's been a while since you've played it. I think I need to look up a video explanation yourself to remember. The, these game stories are pretty complicated, so I do not blame you, Eric. I feel like this game can be really confusing. Like, I don't even think I have fully understood what's going on. Um, doesn't surprise me, though, that Susie is a big Parasite E fan, since I know they're a big Resident Evil fan. That makes sense. Also, how are you doing, Nox? Welcome in. Sorry that we did not... Uh, <laughs> Sorry that that we did not reset it. None of us knew how. Got the collectors looking for a Jotnar, which is the collectorist one. Good luck. I heard that one sold out in like seconds. That is not an easy one. Also, uh, Hefe, Sean is here, but I don't know if he's going to say hi. Did I just say bee's knees? Yeah, the bee, the bee's knees. Bee's knees. You know, bee's knees. Hi, Katoru, by the way. <laughs> it's the bee's knees. Hi, Black Tiger. How are you? Yeah, bee's knees. Beep, be, bee's knees. Like that. How are you doing? <laughs> reset. Thank you for the reset command. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Hi, Butter. Hi, Empo. How are you both? Welcome in. You do be busy. It's true. I look buddy brilliant. Thank you, Rip Talk. Y'all are so sweet. I don't think he Hefe, Sean is trying to sleep, but he does say hi. Telepathically, he says hi. Sometimes you uh, miss your stuff. No, that's okay. It's understandable. I figured it would be easier for me to type it. I, as I was saying it a lot, I realized it might be easier if I just typed it for you. But I don't mind repeating. I am totally okay with that. <laughs> You're doing fine, actually. I'm glad to hear. What's everybody's plans for the day? What are we doing? What are we getting up to? Ayaya reminds you of Aya Matsura, brings back memories of a good time. Ayaya is the name of this girl right here. Her name is Ayaya. Well, we named her Ayaya. Did I get a chance to... I did not yet, handy tips. I promise I will, though. I promise I will. I've been a bit busy. <laughs> Last week was probably my busiest week in a while. And then the week before that was kind of busy. I don't know. I've been, I've been a little bit jam-packed, y'all. I finally get to like chill these next few weeks. 
<laughs> I'm very happy that I can finally like relax these next few weeks. It's been a bit hectic for dear Elise here. I don't know where this box would be. I feel like I am lost, actually. Oh, there's the box. There's a box right here that I already grabbed. <laughs> I'm lost again. Thank you for the follow, much appreciated. Thank you so much. Wait, there's a ladder here? Is this where I came in? I think this is where I came in, right? Yeah, this is where I came in. What if we go this way? <laughs> thank you for the follow. I appreciate it so much. Thank you, thank you. Could you do it for me, Butter? Thank you both, Butter and Knox, for being the bot gods. I'm going to go home in a little bit, grab food, do sponsored things, and then hop on Rise. Good luck, Baron. Hope it all goes well. What are you going to grab for food? Your plans are to just watch streams, maybe start Mega Man 9 at some point and make tacos for dinner. That's literally it. That sounds like a good day in my book, Sins. I think that's the ideal day. <laughs> you had to fly and drive eight hours total. Wait, for what? Why did you have to do that? It's all good. Comes out in October, but definitely very similar to this game aesthetic-wise. Ooh, okay, I'll check it out. I wonder if Plume's checked it out. Because I know Plume is a big fan of this game. I think I might be going the right way now. Mayhaps. Mayhaps. Well, not too good. You're trying to bring yourself back to streaming after stream anniversary, but got too much stuff going on at the moment to be even be on your computer. Honestly, Black Tiger, I try not to stress too much about it. If you have a lot going on, I feel like everybody in your community will understand if you have to like take some time to like work on your own stuff and then come back to streaming. I feel like it shouldn't be like stressful for you to have to like figure out streaming. It should be something fun, you know? So take care of yourself. Always prioritize yourself first. I know that's easier said than done, for sure. But you should always, like, prioritize yourself first. You're living your best life, as you should. Cheers, Butter, you're a star. True, Butter is the star. The, the bot star. <laughs> you're in the mood for a euro, so you might go Greek. Go for it. I haven't had Greek food in a while. How's the story progression? We haven't progressed any story yet. We've just been vibing right now. Um, we're pretty much just trying to get items because I was told I should get items here. So that is what I am doing. But I don't really know what items are going to be back here. You're in South Africa? That's hella cool. Have fun. I've never been there. That's really awesome. What the fuck? Enjoy your trip. Did I do the three-year sub-year badge recently? I did upload. Upload. I did upload two and three years, I think. I think I uploaded up to four years, actually. Now that I'm thinking about it, I think I uploaded up to four years. But they're going to be changed in a bit. They're going to be updated to card capture emotes uh, or card capture badges once I commission the new ones from Kuma. Which title? You think you missed it in chat. Uh, that's a good question. I forget what it's called. Signalis, I think is what it was called. Ayaya, well said, Saoku. Well said. Aya yaing intensified. Well said, Katoru. Well said. We love the Aya ya here. Thank you for the pop as well, Hefe. Um, but yeah, I think it was called Signalis. I think that's what it's called. Handy tips would know better, but I don't know if they're still here. Aya ya. I'm so happy that I now know the origin of B's Aya ya emote. Okay, this is where rocks are. So we obviously can't go here. <laughs> obviously cannot go here. So let's go this way. I'm glad that there's no bats here. Thank you for the no bats. Is it called Signalis Handy Tips? Thank you for the IAs, Willis. Thank you. I thought that middle emote was Jill. <laughs> I was like, oh my god, Jill is an IAI. I thought it was Jill. Hi Bowser, how are you? It looks it looks like Jill to me. <laughs> I now know that it's not Jill, but it's cute. That would be neat. I just it looks like Jill. It do. First time chatter. How are you doing, Bowser? I've seen you in a lot of friends' chats. I hope you're doing well. I hope you're having a good Sunday. Yes, ah yeah yeah. The last I heard it was PC only, so you won't be getting it. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Plume. That sucks. Maybe I can stream it, though. 
I'm just afraid it's gonna soft lock me. <laughs> if it's like this game, if it soft lock me, I will cry. I will cry. I think now that we've gone this way, maybe over here should be some stuff. No. Knock says yes, but Elise says no. But if you say yes, how can you even trust yourself? Is Elise crying on stream necessarily a bad thing though? I think it depends. <gasps> Wait, an item! What's this? It's glowing. Gimme. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Shiny. My inventory is full. Okay. <laughs> this game, it hates me, I swear. Um, let me give myself some more item capacity. Yeah. Give me my shiny, okay? I guess not. I'm gonna drop some of the darkness stuff because I don't really need that many. It's coming out on PlayStation as well. Let's go! Is Elise crying on stream a bad thing? Knock of all says Knox needs a smoke first. Go get a smoke. You played the first Parasite, but you don't remember anything at all. And you are valid. This game is very complicated. The story seems a little intense, but not in a bad way. It's just a lot of science information dropped on you at once. So I feel like that's why it's a bit tricky. Uh, what do I have currently equipped? Do -do 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 -do. I don't even know how I tell what I have currently equipped. What if I just make that stronger? I have less range, but that's okay. <laughs> I have less range, but that's okay. Time to switch out of this horrid uniform. No worries, Baron. Have a great rest of your day. Good luck. Hot take, birth third birthday is greater than Parasite Eve 2. That's a hot take? I wouldn't know. I haven't played either of those. The cancel sound effect sounds a lot like an Android phone hanging up and it sounds weird. I don't know what an Android phone sounds like when it hangs up. Good night, Knox. Enjoy your trip. Please have fun. Take lots of pictures. I don't know what you're doing, but I've never been to South Africa and I would love to see pictures. Um, but that's okay, Bowser. Not remembering stuff is fine. I have the worst memory on earth, I think. The second game isn't as good as this one, but it has good points too. I was told not to play the second one. I was told by many a people to only play the first one. <laughs> Literally to only play the first one. Who looks like a shriveled turnip? Who looks like a shriveled turnip? Wait, what? Time to chill and lurk. Don't worry, you're still gonna be here. No worries, Empo. Thank you for the lurk. I hope you have a great rest of your Sunday. Thank you so much. You have M16A1 equipped, a pretty good weapon. I do like that weapon. The range is really nice. I probably should have used a fence on there, but maybe I'll get another one. Or I can upgrade it somehow. But I'll save before I upgrade stuff. It is a really hot take, how come? This is actually FF7 in at least 33% of all realities of the multiverse. That feels true. That feels true. Wasn't this game originally supposed to be Final Fantasy VII? I hope that you're able to play it though, Plume. I feel like if it's inspired by this game, it's definitely something that you would like. Knowing you, I just know that. Um, let's see. We're now at 17. Uh, I don't think there's anything in here. I think we have to go all the way to the other side. Like, it says that there's something in this room, but there's definitely not. interesting interesting okay let's go back up this way when you make a choice all choices are made simultaneously hence i see third is worse in every way and gets out creepy i have heard many a thing and i don't know if i would like to experience it myself i might like watch a playthrough of it i don't think i would want to experience it myself how do you avoid this shit in a tiny hallway Nice! Okay, now 
now I'm gonna miss. Which kind of is a bummer, but it's okay. Nox! Nox, thank you for the tip. Wait, what the heck? Hold on. I cannot read that message. I'm gonna have to go look at it in a second. Why don't I have text to speech on for tips? I need that. At first I was like, wait. Hi, Tenza. So what is Parasite Eve like? I've heard it's kind of like Resident Evil, but with RPG elements. It is, Eric. So it's instead of being like Resident Evil where it's action and you run around, um, it's essentially like, you do obviously run around, but you have an action bar where you have to wait until your action bar is full before you can shoot, use items, or use your like energy. It's called like PE. Um, so it has RPG elements. I like it. It's a bit less stressful for me. I love Resident Evil, but it is a bit less stressful for me because I have time to like think out my actions since it is kind of turn-based. Um, but I do really dig it. But thank you, Nox. Thank you for the tip. I will read the message after because I can't find it. Let me see. I would load stream elements, but last time I load, loaded stream elements, it like broke my OBS. So I will have to check afterwards and then I'll just message Nox. <laughs> The second one is okay, not horrible, but certainly not great. That's what I've heard. It's just not, um, it's just not as beloved. It just means they can't avoid your bullets either. True, the soundtrack, Yoko Shigemimura, yes. The person who created this soundtrack is amazing. They also did Super Mario RPG. Thank you, Tenza, for liking my cosplay. Hi, Flight, can we get a shout out for Flight? How are you? Always seen it as more of a cinematic RPG. I think that's a good description. Is it scary? And do you have you do you have to worry about your inventory? You do have to worry about your inventory, but not as bad. I feel like not as bad as in like Resident Evil. Like I haven't really struggled with having inventory. At least not yet. But I do struggle with having healing items, I would say. Wait, that's gonna show. No! No! These bats are evil. Hi, coach. How are you? Oh, I had to reload. That sucks. Um, okay. I'm running out of these, I think. I need to be more careful. How are you doing, coach? I don't have a Lilith, but I would love to have a Lilith. Lilith is cool. I just like Morgan's color scheme a little bit better. It's the only reason why I went with Morgan instead. Literally the only reason it was just that I like I like her color scheme better. You're okay? How's your Sunday? I would say it's not very scary. Like I haven't had moments where I feel scared. It's more so, um, it has body horror, so it can be a bit disturbing. If you played the other Parasite Eve game though, I am assuming that it would be the same. I've never played like Third Birthday, so I can't really speak to that, but I would assume Third Birthday has about the same levels of body horror, and that would all be all you have to expect. Truly, that would be it. It's just like body horror disturbing stuff. Just your back and leg are annoying you. My neck has been annoying me, but it's because I go shrimp mode while I work. And that is not smart. Do not sacrifice your posture, friends. Do not sacrifice it. You're trying not to also spoil, but yes. Wait, spoil what? I don't think you have to worry about spoiling. Shrimp mode? Yeah, I go into shrimp mode. I feel like it's sci sciatica? Am I saying that right? You like my Felicia cosplay? Thanks, gimmick. I think, I, I don't think I could ever pull off Felicia. Felicia is very, her outfit is very intense. It's driving me nuts, not gonna lie. Is there a way to like treat it at all? Can you treat it? Creepy is underselling it. Mayhaps, I cannot speak on that. Inventory management is the biggest issue. Yeah, ammo, ammo hasn't really been a big concern. It's usually healing items, I think that are the biggest problem. Like, see, I only have one healing item here and you can use these, but from what I've been told, it's not good to use those. 
Like you would really want to use the actual healing items that the game gives you. And that's why I'm just kind of like, eh, okay. So I, I definitely need to find some more healing items in here. We'll see if I can. Probably just physical therapy stuff and stretching. Let's all do a stretch. Let's all do a stretch real quick. That's what we need. <laughs> But I'm glad that people like my, my cosplay. How are you, Gimmick? Can we get a shout out for Gimmick, please? Thanks for the explanation, everyone. You are very welcome. Third birthday was basically an action game, so not really that scary. Yeah, then, I mean, I would say this game falls along the same lines. It's not very scary. It's honestly pretty normal. It's just got some body horror stuff, which like for me, that's not a big deal. A lot of my favorite anime and manga have body horror in it. So that's never really been a problem for me. Thank you, Gimmick. You don't have to shout me out of my own stream, though. Third birthday would have been promising as a different IP, but it's definitely not Parasite Eve. Ah, okay. I can understand that, too. All right, here we go. We're going to walk through here. Please, no bats. Please, no bats. <laughs> I'm going to have bats later. Gimmick, no! You don't got to shout me out. Still more than the Resident that Resident Evil wannabe that is PE2. I'm kind of sad that they tried to make it more like Resident Evil with the second one. I feel like this game was so good on its own with like its own combat and everything. But I guess because Resident Evil was more successful, I'm assuming, is why they decided to do that. It's just a bummer. Makes me bummed. I do plan on doing an Aya cosplay at some point, though. My inventory is full, Elise. See, this is the struggle. I want to increase my item capacity, and I can't. So you know what that means. Let's get rid of the poison. Maybe the poison stuff is not important. Watch it be important in like a boss fight or something. Maybe I can get more. But I, I need I need inventory space. Vagrant Story also had a neat variant of the targeting area mechanic. I have Vagrant Story, I think, on Vita as well. Wait, let me check. Oh. Can I look at my homepage from here? I thought I could. Maybe I can't. Yeah, I can. Yeah, Vagrant Story right there. Super tool. What does super tool do? What does super tool do? Parasite Eve came out before Vagrant Story. That I don't know. But yeah, see, I have Sui Coden. I have Parasite Eve. I have Legend of Dragoon. I have Final Fantasy IX, which I've played, but I just love it. I have Dissidia, which I've never played. Hi, Baker. How are you doing today? Can we get a shout out for Baker, please? I only just found out about Vagrant Story, Chief, but I've heard really good things about it. So I kind of want to check it out at some point. Um, I have Final Fantasy IV. That's for Willis. I don't know if Willis is still here, but look at that. Final Fantasy IV. I will play it one day. And then I have a Lundra. I have a Lundra as well. But yeah. I have a lot of games on here. And I plan on getting more. I've never played Dissidia. Super Tool allows you to keep the gear you're transferring mods from. Oh, okay. That's pretty neat. That is pretty neat. So I could transfer, like, wait. I don't even know what I have. I don't know what these mods do. <laughs> have I ever played T-R-A-G? No, I have not. What's that? I have not played After Years. I've never played any Final Fantasy for like, stuff. Um, I've only played, um, let's go in order because it's easier, six. Crisis Core, 7, uh, 7 Remake, um, 9, 10, uh, 15, and 14. That's all I've played. Well, that's a lot of guns. As it, Yeah, it is Glass Emperor because I'm afraid. You need to get rid of that multi-shot and replace it with Command times 2 slash 3. How do I get rid of multi-shot? Also, on which weapon are we talking about? Because I don't know what any of the icons mean, for the record. Highly underrated game, a lot of fun. I can try to see if it's on the PS TV. There's a lot of PS1 classics on uh, the Vita, so maybe it would be there. 
Every time you mention it, no one has heard of it, though. Some games are very underrated. Multi-shot lowers your damage per shot. You need super tools to get of the multi-shot and replace it. Which one has multi-shot on it, though? This one? Is that what that has? Or is it the times three? I am streaming using a PSTV, correct. Correct, correct. That is exactly what I'm doing. <laughs> I am streaming a PSTV. It's another game set in the world of Ivalice, like Final Fantasy Tactics in 12. I'd have Tactics, too. Um, but I don't have every game downloaded on to the TV. I need to do that. Yeah, I'm a little confused which... So I want to replace it with the times 2 or times 3, but this is this the one that has it? I'm assuming that's what that means. Like the multi-shot is this thing. But if I'm not using this weapon... Oh no, Austin, it's okay. I appreciate it. I don't consider that backseating. I'm, answer question, I'm asking questions just so that I understand the super tool before I use it. I don't know what this does. Like, I don't know what any of these icons mean. I literally have no idea what any of these icons mean. Is that first something that I would want? What does that first icon mean? Does anybody know? Tactics was great. The cameos were... Um, a welcoming surprise. I just wish I, I had a better understanding of what these icons mean. That's truly all. I don't know. I don't know what these icons mean. So it's very difficult for me to just be like, yeah, I want this skill. I don't even know what it is. At least forgetting to end every sentence with D's nuts. We're going to consider any questions I have about tools and stuff to be a D's nuts situation, okay? That is what we're going to consider. <laughs> All right, you beautiful people. But yeah, I have no idea. I genuinely don't know. You know what? Let's just let's just keep going. I know you can move your cursor over these icons. I just can't remember the screen. That just changes what I have equipped. So it's not that. Uh, mm. I don't know. That's a lot of D's nuts. It would be a lot of D's nuts, right, Ber right, Derpy? I think Boss just wants to hear me say D's nuts. Truth be told, I think Boss just wants to hear me say D's nuts. I don't know why, but I think that's what Boss wants. Let's look at the map. We're going to go to the left. I think we haven't explored the left. Can we handle so much D's nuts? I don't know. Hi, Danny boy. Is that how I say that, Danny boy? Should I just call you Danny? Let me know. RPGs make you want to pay, pull your hair out when you start them and then want to get a tattoo of the main character once you finish. Kind of true, actually. Although, there have been... Oh my god, a cursed darkness. Seriously. Hear you say what? Say these nuts. I feel like I, that was, that was uh, me slipping into... <laughs> think I, got, I, got, I think I got trapped. Um, okay, we're going to go towards this way. Yay, no bats! The heart wants what it wants, I guess. And boss wants these nuts. Okay. Medicine four! We finally found a healing item, everybody. It only took forever. <laughs> no! Not the bats! And a worm. Okay, it's a bat and a worm. But I might regret getting rid of all my poison now. Just kidding, I'm the best. I think this gun is pretty good right now. I don't have any space for these cure darkness. Um, so that's kind of an issue, but let's see. I guess we're going to go down now. Easy GG. Yeah. This is definitely way easier than the warehouse. I tell you what. Hi, Jeff. Thank you so much. Thank you, guys. I feel like I say this almost every week. But this today I was super self-conscious <laughs> about this cosplay for sure. And I wasn't sure if I looked enough like Morgan. So y'all are making my day. Hi, Slamma. How are you? 
Slamma is very cool. We are all Slamma fans. Can we get a shout out for these Slamma Cowser, please? How are you doing? What does a trading card do? Normal trading card. I don't know what that does. I do have tools, though. Super tool. Moves equipped parameter or effect. Okay. Okay. It's self-care Sunday, so I only vibe and hang out. As you should. Enjoy your Sunday however you need to. <gasps> Ooh. 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 I'm OP now. I'm OP. Hi, B. How are you? Can we get a shout out for B? Welcome in. I'm really bad at this game, B. <laughs> I feel like I should preface this by letting you know, since I know you love this game very much. I am very bad at this game, but I'm doing really good. Thank you. Gotta hop, but I hope y'all enjoy your Sunday. I hope you enjoy your Sunday too, Derpy. Thank you for hanging out for a bit. Hi, Slamma. You're so cute. Well said, Willis. Well said. Looks so good, though. Thank you, Dave. That's really sweet of you to say. Thank you so much. Right? Jing, she's devil luck. Costume is so good. <laughs> Thank you, gimmick. I remember seeing announced this cosplay on Discord and every day hoping that I wouldn't miss it. It's super timely, too, since Capcom released that Darkstalkers collection. I want the Darkstalkers collection so bad. I really love all of the designs of the characters in Darkstalkers. It makes me happy. Do I want to know what a trading card does? Yes, Austin, please tell me. I have a lot of questions. I have a lot of questions about tools and stuff. So, um, Austin or B or Plume, if y'all want to help me figure it out, <laughs> I appreciate it because I truly don't know. What does this do? Oh, this has rate of fire. Okay, so that's rate of fire. If I equip it, I can look at it. Oh, rate of fire 7, random rate of fire 1.5. That does not sound fun. You can answer most things, but it's a novel. That's okay. I don't mind reading novels. That's okay. <laughs> Random is not good. Okay, so that weapon's kind of stinky. Noted. I don't want that. All right, what does this have? Rate of fire two, and then that's just nothing. Random can be good, just not here. Okay. What does the little blank slot mean? Does that mean like that's a blank slot that I can put new abilities to? Trading cards act like mod permits and increase the amount of mods you can have on a gun and armor. Okay, so that's like what that little slot is. Yes? Yes? No? Maybe? You bought the Darkstalkers collection just to play Puzzle Fighter? I've never played Puzzle Fighter. I only know Darkstalkers. This has a lot of space. So what does this have on it? I'm just curious. Steal items but halves attack power. That's, mm, I don't know if I want that. I don't know if I want that. These ones means the slot is closed and no ability can go there. Oh, that makes me sad. Quick draw, wait, I want this, but not on a club. I got M10 instead of, yeah, I get random. I get random items. I like my G23, though. But I kind of want that first, like, I want that first ability on something else. Like, I would like it on the G23. Let's see. Or this gun. This gun's nice. But it does make me sad that I can't put anything on there. This doesn't have an open slot, though, or does it? Or does it? I am bad at telling this stuff. It looks like it does. Do I have any other clubs? No, I only have club three. I did do a few modifications, which I probably shouldn't have in retrospect, but I sadly can't mod unless I have the others. Oh, that is a bummer because I need to always have a club. Wait, that's so sad. That's so sad. That's why you always want command times two times three since those give 100% attack or allow you to attack and use PE in one turn. Ah, okay. That's so sad, I didn't know that. I should have kept my clubs. I use them without knowing. This game is so unforgiving, oh my goodness. <laughs> That kind of stuff is a while away. If I recall, clubs are great for farming junk off of birds. Oh, okay. I am learning a lot. This has acid bullets. I, I guess there's nothing that I would really want to modify yet. 
How many tools do I have? Let's see. I have one. And then I have one super tool. I have one tool and one super tool. And then I have a lot of cures. And a trading card. But I don't really know what to do with the trading card and everything else. Do I have any in storage? Possibly. I could go check. I do have to put like a few things into storage anyway. I have a lot of stuff that I'm not using. Only two tools worries me? I'm scared. I'm very scared. I think... <laughs> I'm so scared. I'm still exploring the sewer, but I don't have many items left. And I think I got the other item that you get in here. Hold on, let me see. Yeah. I do have the other item, so that's not... That won't have anything. And I think I went to area 11 and got the medicine three. So yeah, I've pretty much gotten all of the items in here. I don't need to keep the charms. Always throw those away. Oh, I can throw them both away? Oh, it doesn't let me discard them. Only one, I can only throw away one. Why doesn't it let me discard them? Shady! I have to store? Okay, let's go out. Let's go back. Shady, thank you for the raid! Shady, thank you so, so much! Oh my goodness. Hello! I'm gonna have to ask for help again, but don't worry, I will scroll up. I think I just have to leave this area and go back and put some stuff in storage, but that is okay. I can do that. Hello, Sushi. Hello, Animagus. I think I'm saying that right. If I'm not, you may yell at me. Hello, Madden. Hello, Char Charlations. Hello, Turf and DL. Hello, Vixie. Hello, Ace. Hello, everybody that came from Shady's Raid. My name is Elise. I am a variety streamer. I stream mostly JRPGs, but I do also stream a lot of action games, most notably um, Soulsborne games or Monster Hunter. Um, I do also play a lot of visual novels. My favorites are Danganronpa and I, the Somnium Files. Um, and then I'm a very chatty streamer. I end up getting distracted and making a lot of mistakes in games because I end up talking to my community a lot. So if that's your jam, hello, welcome. Um, today I'm cosplaying Morgan and I am playing Parasite Eve. Um, but yeah, welcome in. Thank you for the raid. How are you? We're super engaging. We just like talking with people. It's a vibe. It's a vibe. Hi, Dutchie. Welcome in. How are you? Love your face too. Audio issues and can't hear anything. Oh, I'm sorry. Hold on. Let me think. Let me think, Shady. I'm so sorry. I'm bad at typing and talking at the same time. I'm so bad at typing and talking at the same time. Hi, Iceman, how are you? Can we get a shout out for Iceman, please? As well as Shady, if we didn't get one already, but I think we did. We did get one, okay, I can read. I can read. <laughs> How's everybody doing though? I do like to get to know everybody, so I like to ask, um, what is your favorite anime and what is your favorite game? If you can't decide on one, you can pick more than one because I like to get to know everyone. It also helps me get suggestions, to be honest. Um, but I'm a big anime fan. Oh, wait, I didn't get the item in here. What's in here? My inventory's full. <laughs> Once you get out of the server and return, I can guide you through it fast, only if you want. No, it's okay. Um, I have a map open, um, but we'll... <laughs> I literally have a map because if I didn't have a map, I would be lost in here for like 10 years. Um, I don't know if I want to discard any of this stuff. I guess I can just discard one of these. Even the map is confusing. If I get lost, cure. Good night. Good night, everybody. <laughs> I discarded a cure D to get a cure D. Pain. Even the map is confusing. You know what? True. True. I'll ask for help for sure. Because I do not like getting lost. <laughs> not when there's bats everywhere who are trying to murder me. You know? 
fave game, definitely Kingdom Hearts. You're not an anime person, though. And that is totally fine. Not everybody likes anime, and it's okay. My twin sister actually doesn't like anime very much. So that's fine. Favorite anime, Ruby and Soul Eater. Favorite game, Kingdom Hearts. We got a lot of Kingdom Hearts fans. That's really cool. I've only ever played Birth by Sleep and finished it. I have never finished Kingdom Hearts 1 or any like other game, only Birth by Sleep. So I apologize <laughs> in advance. I played it out of order. Uh, favorite game, Super Mario World. Favorite anime, Dragon Ball. Interesting. I don't hear a lot of people say Super Mario World's their fave. Yu Yu Hakusho and Slam Dunk, game Super Mario World. Another Super Mario World fan, wait, hold up. This tends to be a place that gets people. It's the bats. I don't wanna blame the bats, but it's definitely the bats. <laughs> it's definitely the bats, I'm just saying. Is it gonna shoot the stuff at me? Yeah, it is, okay. At least that's how it is for me. These bats are kicking my butt. Ah! All right. More Cure Ds, nice. Anime Blue Exorcist and Black Clover game Final Fantasy 14 and 10. That's really cool, Ace. I don't see a lot of people say Blue Exorcist and I really like that anime. The first season opening is so good. That's a banger. Favorite anime so far, AOT, SAO, Demon Slayer, Fave Game, Kingdom Hearts 2, Tomb Raider, and Resident Evil. Ooh, nice. I gotta play Kingdom Hearts 2? I would like to. I would like to play Kingdom Hearts 2. I've been told to play the Kingdom Hearts series, so I think I wanna do, there's so many games Activating to play. Mode. Personally, I think I would do one, two, and three, and then play the others. Wait, Iceman, thank you for the sub. Thank you so, so much, Iceman. Thank you, we in combat mode now. Ba -da -da. Thank you. I can't hit that note. <laughs> thank you so much. Slamma, thank you for the biddies. Hi, T Gamer. I'm doing well. How are you? A person with taste. Well much said. I think you all have thank taste. Thank you. I do have a twin. Yeah, I do have a twin. We're fraternal, though. The bats are assholes. Agreed. They are assholes. I like Attack on Titan. I like Demon Slayer a lot. I can't speak about Tomb Raider or Kingdom Hearts 2 because I haven't played those yet, but I do like Resident Evil. You wish you were, though. You've tried many times to get into it. It's okay, Dutchie. It's not for everybody. But yeah, I do have a twin. I do have a twin. <laughs> uh, I like her, but we're into different things. As someone who thought I'd do one, two, and three and get a lot of people coming and are like, no, play the ball. I mean, I would like to. There's just so many. There's literally so many. It's the most daunting series, I feel like, in existence. It's so daunting. But... <laughs> But maybe I will play, I will, I will, you know what? I will play one, two, and three, and then if I feel like it, I will play the others. How about that? People are gonna come in and I'm gonna be like, if I feel like it, let me feel like it. All right, hold on. I think I gotta go this way. Yeah, let's go this way. Maybe? There is a box here. You played Final Fantasy in order. I've played it out of order. I started with 15 and then went back. And I, 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 if I start at 15, there's no point playing it in order. <laughs> I'm very late to Final Fantasy. But yeah, Final Fantasy 15 was my first one. And then I went back and I did um, 9, 10, 7, and Crisis Core, which I'm a really big Crisis Core fan. If you would like to see, hold on. I, I realized I didn't show y'all my crazy ass room. Um, the first birthday, it is the first birthday. It is the first birthday. But if I, it, as you can tell, I, I like things in a very chill way. Um, but I have my crisis core stuff everywhere. Um, and then I have Vivi over there and I have Final Fantasy IX over there. And I have Final Fantasy IX soundtrack is covered by my mic. I've got a meal from Muir and I got Iba, my little Iba plushie, whom I love and my Iba figure right next to her. I cannot point very well, right there. But yeah, I, I like things in a very non-chill way. <laughs> I like to collect things. I am a little, a little nuts. You're the better twin, right? Unless my twin also likes Hamtaro. She was not a Hamtaro fan, but she likes a lot of movies and such. So I don't know, it depends. Also, how are you doing Bacon Pancakes? Same, but you started with 12. I've never played 12, but I've heard good things. 
You're starting with Remake? Ooh, that's a tough one. I know a lot of people started with Remake, but I feel like I don't recommend it usually. Because I feel like Remake... It doesn't necessarily require you to play the compilation, but I personally feel like it does. I feel like it does. Final Fantasy 1 was your first, and then 7 was your second. Not sure what happened in between all of that. A lot of good stuff. A lot of good stuff. Final Fantasy doesn't exist past 10 2. Wait, why? I heard 11 was really good, but it's an MMO. Remake is a weird starting point. I just feel like it, you could end up confused because you don't get the whole story and I feel like they do rely on you knowing parts of the original story. So I don't usually recommend people play Remake first. Your fave anime is JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, Yu Yu Hakusho, Demon Slayer, and Mobile Suit Gundam. We got some Gundam fans. It's Resident Evil, Final Fantasy, and Parasite Eve. You got good taste. I love to see it. 12 is actually great. I need to play it. I need to play it. I have so many that I need to play. All right, we're going back to the NYPD. What's Mystic Quest? <laughs> Wait, what is that? You have a lot of friends saying FF6 was top tier. You need to play them all. I did like Final Fantasy VI when I played it. Um, I still think Kuja's my favorite villain though. A lot of people told me I would change my mind and I would like Kefka more, but I still like Kuja most. The Zodiac Age. Yeah, the Zodiac Age. You should play six though, Chief. I've heard five is really good. Like five is a very underrated title. I don't know what Mystic Quest is. I've never even heard of it. Never heard of it. I really feel you need to play OG FF7 to get the most. I think Crisis Core is now required too, Plume. In all honesty, I feel like Crisis Core is needed as well. Baking pancakes, making bacon pancakes. Make some bacon, then I put it in a pancake. I, every time I see bacon pancakes, I think of Slamma thinking, uh, uh, like singing bacon pancakes. Bacon pancakes. It's a good one. It's a good one. It can be hit or miss. You don't think it's the best, but some people didn't care for it. I see. Where are this man at? I'm doing good though. I'm vibing. Hi, Joey. My day is good. I have not made a lot of progress in Parasite Eve, to be honest, but that is totally fine by me because I am chilling. <laughs> I am chilling and I'm having a good day. This game is a bit intense, I have to say. Okay, we can... Oh, I have one of these in here. Should I leave this in here or should I take it and upgrade stuff? I'm not sure. FF9, best FF. It's my favorite. By far, it's my favorite. Can I not move it there? Oh, I have to keep one. Right. That's right. I do have to keep one. So maybe I keep this one? Five is an overlooked gem. Helpful good luck charm. Special good luck charm. Okay. How come I can't move this one? Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> I love Tenet has your favorite character. Who's your favorite character? Are we all, are we all FF9 fans? Is that what I'm learning today? I hope so. I hope we're all FF9 fans. Is CC short for Crystal Chronicles? It's cr it, uh, Crisis Core. Crisis Core. Would you guys like to see my Crisis Core PSP again? Hold on. You have to have one, unfortunately. Wait. Good luck charm. Special good luck charm. So I have to keep two? I thought this counted. <laughs> Damn it. It doesn't count. What you guys? It does nothing, but it is required. Why would they make me require... An item that does nothing. I think they hate me. But anyways, here's my Crisis Core PSP. I have to keep one. Oh, okay. This is complicated. I'm on day five. Yes, I'm on day five. But look at my Crisis Core. Look at my Crisis Core PSP. I am really happy about this. I am very happy about this. Thank you. <laughs> I'm just going to bring it out to everyone in the world and show it. I'm like, please look at my Crisis Core PSP. Please perceive. Please perceive. One should be movable. Okay. 
I wonder if it's like the first one you have to keep. The second one doesn't matter. Yeah, so I have to keep the first one. That's what it is. I have to keep the first one. Discard junk. Take my junk. You should have the Crisis Core PSP. I don't have a glass display case yet, but if I do get one, I will absolutely do that. I will absolutely do that. I have to find a place for my um, Zach Fair figure as well. Because I don't know where I'm going to put it. Rate my rare tea card collection? What is that? Um, I'm going to store the vest for now since I'm not using it. And I don't know what I want to upgrade. I feel like I should store other stuff too. Like any guns that I'm not using. Since I can't use the club, maybe I should store that right now. Or Oh no, I have to have the club. Correct. B said I have to have the club. Whatever I ha get on day five, I'm stuck with. Oh, okay. Do I have a minute? <laughs> Do you have a minute to talk about Crisis Core? I just would love talking about Crisis Core. It's my favorite. It's my favorite, like, not mainline Final Fantasy game. Your favorite video games are Planescape, Fallout, XCOM, and Mass Effect. When it comes to RPGs, West Temi, Best Temi. I've never played that before. Honestly, those are all games that I've never played before. I can't really see. I feel like I haven't used a lot of these. Let me check. Let me check. I'm doing good. Thank you for asking. I'm a little confused with this game and I'm afraid that I'm not gonna. <laughs> I'm truly afraid that I'm not gonna have enough items that I need to beat the game. But we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Thank you for the follow, by the way. Much appreciated. I do have anonymous follows on just because I don't like calling people out of lurk. Um, but if you do want to introduce yourself, please feel free. If you'd rather stay lurking, that is totally okay too. Um, I feel like I should keep this gun and maybe like upgrade the attack. Maybe. Maybe. Like give it the plus two offense or something. Because it has really good range. Like really good range but I don't know. Welcome home, Tenza. Planescape is what Undertale wanted to be. I love Undertale. Maybe I would like Planescape. You'll be able to farm items in the next area. Okay. So maybe I should just try to make it through the next area. I feel like I could put that gun away. Yeah, let's put the M10 away. Welcome home, Tenza. Okay, let's store. Will I be able to come back here again? Or if I go through the sewers, will I not be able to come back here again? You hosted and followed. Thank you for the host, Ace. Much appreciated. And thank you for the follow, too. Thank you so much. Uh, hmm. You can, yes? Okay, thank you. <laughs> I'm obviously very paranoid. <laughs> Because in my other save, I almost soft lapped myself by going into the warehouse, not knowing that the warehouse was kind of a scary place. Um, and I couldn't get out of the warehouse. Did I get into the warehouse fine? Yes, but could I get out of the warehouse? No, I could not. Thank you for the follow, much appreciated. I do have anonymous follows on just because I don't like calling people out of lurk, but if you do want to introduce yourself, please feel free. Uh, we love getting to know new people. If you'd rather stay lurking, though, that's okay, too. Did I get the stuff at the gate? I did not. Should I just go get the stuff at the gate right now? It has the first command. Let me just go get it. I was honestly scarred. <laughs> I was scarred last stream that I did not go to the warehouse again. I was like, I'm never going there again. I'm never going there again. But I do want to fight the crab. I love crabs, okay? They're really they're really cute. And I'm a little sad that it's such a hard enemy because I wish I could fight it. But maybe in another playthrough, you know? Maybe in another playthrough I'll do that. Not this one though. It's very hidden and out of view, but super worth it. Okay. Thank you, Ace. I'm glad that you think so. I'm honestly very appreciative of everybody here. Thank y'all for hanging out with me on your Sunday. It's definitely tough once you figure out the crab, it's not so bad. <laughs> we don't speak of the warehouse. Yeah, the warehouse is a bit traumatizing for me, um, but we're going. It makes people crabby. Is the crab really that bad from those who have played it? Like how, how on a scale of one to 10, how bad 
is the crab. Maybe I should have been hinted at by like this dude, like running away. Crab is a super boss, oh. I like that they made the crab the super boss though. Enjoy your lurk, Tenza. Hello, doggo. Okay, I'm gonna go. Ah! I'm so scared to go in here. Okay, I don't have to go in to get it. It's You get the stuff at the gate of the warehouse, okay. I did get some of the good stuff, but there's one to the left that I can't see. Oh, I got a tool. Ooh, there's the PPK. The t why would <laughs> That's so interesting. Okay, hold on. Let me see this. That is so cool. You had your chest mixed. That's okay. I honestly probably would do the same, but this is so neat. Okay. So would I be able to like take that skill and put it on this gun perhaps? Although I wonder which one's better. Which one would be better in this case? The PPK or like the G23? I don't know anything about guns. Thank you for the lurk, MKB. Also, thank you for the follow to whoever followed. I really appreciate it. I do have anonymous follows on just because I don't like calling people out of lurk. Um, but feel free to chat and introduce yourself if you want or stay lurking. That's okay. Um, I just don't know which guns are good. I think that's my only issue is I get afraid of like editing guns if I don't know if they're good. There does look like there is a slot to mod it. Would it be worth it to mod it to the G23? I feel like it would, but I honestly don't know. Have I been using my, I have, but I feel like I used them irresponsibly. <laughs> I have 85. I could. Wait, no, not that. I don't think I have enough points to really do anything. No, I don't. Can make it potentially. So yeah, range and damage. Welcome back, Empo. I need a hundred. Okay, so I would need a hundred. But would it be worth it to just like increase that? This range has it has more range though. It does have more range, too. Hmm. 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 I don't know. I find the M1911A pistol found in a box in the sewers has the best stats of all the available guns for the first playthrough. Do I have that? I don't have that. That is not in here. I might have asked. <laughs> that might have been a weapon that accidentally got morbed without even meaning to. You stow, I stowed it? Wait, hold on, let's go look. We're leaving the warehouse. This is preparation for me beating this game. It's all worth it, let me go check. I really hope that I have it because there have been times, like let me tell you, there have been times where I have fucked it up. <laughs> And I have accidentally, like, put a weapon into another weapon without meaning to. <laughs> Music in this game is so good, though. Honestly, makes it all worth it. Alright, let's see. Please have my gun. <laughs> I would like my gun, please. No, it's not there. It's not there. Sad. It's not there. I did not store it. Unless I stored it in like the items thing, but I don't think you can. I don't think it allows you to. Yeah, it's not there. 
So I do not have that gun. Did I scrap slash sell it? I probably scrapped it in the sense of like, I used it to upgrade another weapon. When I didn't quite understand how like the gun stuff worked. Which I, in retrospect, I probably should have waited until I understood it more. But yeah, unless I didn't find it yet too. Is it in the sewers that I'm currently in or is it in the past sewers? I wonder if I'd still be able to do it without that gun though. I'm not sure. I honestly don't know. Ah, uh, it's the M870 that has burst that's also in the sewers. Wait. I need to find the M870. It's the one that I'm in. Okay, so maybe I just haven't found it yet. That is a potential. I'm also very hungry. Round and round and round we go. G23 would be my go-to. We'll see if we can get um, some else, like something else. Did I find the hidden screens in Chinatown? I don't think so. Where would those be? Hi, Darth. How are you? Welcome in. Can we get a shout out for Darth? At least looking at weapons, it's Morbin time. I thought I understood it. At one point, I thought I genuinely understood it, and then I didn't. Does this take me out? It does. I just wanted to see. PSTV? There we go. Is in a room hidden on the right on the next screen? Okay, I'll find it. I'll find it. Thank you, boss. But yeah, let's figure this out. Oh, I just remembered. I meant to say to whoever um, mentioned that they liked Sword Art Online that I recommend there's this anime that uh, my partner and I started watching um, called like that time I got reincarnated as a slime and it's actually really cute and funny. <laughs> it's actually very cute and funny. Maybe it's in here? Oh, PE plus one. Hold on. Is there like another thing here? Medicine three, okay. You need to find this area in the real Chinatown? Good luck. I feel like it would look very different. It's the screen right before the sewers? Okay. Well, at least I got another medicine. That's really nice. How are you doing though, Darth? How's your day? Oh, okay. Oh God. That is not nice. You can't hit me, no! No hitting me. Oh, I'm gonna miss all those shots. Ow. Um, okay. I don't think I ever saw it attack. Okay, that works. Hi, Mooku, how are you? Can we get a shout out for Mooku, please? This game seems more challenging than Resident Evil in ways. Like personally, I feel like it is more challenging. Um, I don't really wanna use my healing stuff right now. So I think I'll just use this to heal. I normally would not, but I feel like I should. It is for sure. I remember when people were like, oh, it's turn-based. It's like less action-y. I was like, oh, okay. That won't be so bad. But honestly, it's been kicking my ass quite a bit. And not necessarily in a bad way. It's just intense. Uh... Oh, there we go. My inventory is full. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Aya, for always having my inventory full. I feel like most of the challenge comes from it being clunkier. It's also just very unforgiving. Like if you don't understand the mechanics, I feel like you can easily F yourself over. 
the truth is, like, I feel like you can easily F yourself over. There's the gun. That's pretty nice. Okay. You're heading out. Great job with my... Thanks, Gimmick. Thank you, Gimmick. I appreciate it. Get rid of Curdies or save one. I'll save one for sure. I've ended up needing them a few times. I guess I could use this, right? On my armor. I've got boss weapons. Thank you for the boss weapons. I'm overburdened. I'm over encumbered. You just beat Final Fantasy V. How did you like it, Moogle? Did you enjoy it? That's awesome. You know what? This one's you are right. Thank you, Dave. But yeah, I feel like it's just very unforgiving. Like it just has moments where like you can easily mess up. Today has been good. That's good. The tool's on the right. Okay, let me find it. Where's my tool? I'm just spamming X for the record. Hmm. Oh, I found it. <laughs> Aya needs to be facing us all. I found it. We got it. We got it. Dyed my hair. I wish, Junior. I don't think I could pull off this color, though. The truth is, I really don't think I could pull off this color. Not on the daily. Okay, I got the tool. Okay, nice. You remember it's Spam X Oni Musha? It's a very strong color. I love it. Um, I just don't know if I could pull it off on a daily basis. I think now you could build a decent gun. Let's go back to NYPD then, and we can try to build a decent gun. But I would like to have the advice of everybody before I do it because I don't want to mess it up. That would be like the worst for me is if I mess it up. That big old cat hurt me. I actually don't know if it's a cat. I think it is. Definitely save beforehand, no worries. I 100% will. This game has taught me a lot um, about saving. It's a cat, yes? Okay, noted. Sometimes I confuse their cats for rats and I feel bad. Does a dye color like that change a lot? I've noticed a lot of the pastel colors, they just fade very quickly. And I don't know if I'd be up for like the maintenance of that. That's my only issue. Like I've noticed like pink can fade to like a really nice like pastel pink. I don't know about purple. Um, but I feel like a lot of the pastel colors, they fade and you have to be like careful about that. Hi, Kyan, how's your Sunday going? But yeah, I'm very grateful to have all of y'all's help today because I do really want to get through this game, but I've learned that like you can easily F it up and I don't want to fuck it up. <laughs> I don't want to fuck it up. Just waking up. Good morning, then. All right, let's go save really quick. And then we'll see what type of gun we want to make. Unfortunately, the club is kind of useless now, which is a bummer. But that's okay. At least we have that club. Thank you, Voltic. How are you doing today? Can we get a shout out for Voltic? Maybe one day if I do another charity stream, I'd be down to do like dyeing my hair as like a charity stream thing. I don't know if I'd have it be permanent though. That might be scary, but we'll see. Thank you, boss. Okay, let's go in there. I'm gonna make sure I grab like all the guns that I need out of storage. Making some progress on your story? Oh, congrats, that's awesome. I'm glad that everybody is seemingly having like a very chill, like nice Sunday. Make sure y'all take care of yourselves. All right, let's see. Um, Actually, before I talk to Wayne, let's look at the inventory that I have. I personally think if I transfer to tax stats from the G223 to the M191182 and first command from PPK, I'll have something good. Okay. So 
So let me make sure I have those guns. So I need the M1911A2 and I need the G23. And then I need the PPK. So I have all of that. So I'll just store the rest <laughs> so that I don't F this up. Okay, M79, move. Oh, can I not move it? Probably not. It's probably gonna get mad at me for moving things. And that is okay. All right, we have to keep that. I can't move that apparently. I just don't wanna accidentally click on something wrong, which I know that I will do. <laughs> I will absolutely do that <laughs> if, I, if I'm not careful. So, okay. If only there was a super we a weapon to super tool the rate of fire off to. I do not know. You have to go deal with some things. It was nice to meet you. It was nice to meet you too, Ace. Good luck with whatever you have to deal with. <laughs> I just don't wanna misclick. So I feel like it's easier to get rid of stuff. Okay, so I need to transfer the attack stats from G23 to the M19. So when doing that, right? When doing that, which one do you select first to transfer the attack stats? That's why you're smart and save beforehand. I'm trying to do like everything you can to avoid effing it up and watch me still eff it up. I'm telling y'all, I will likely still um, eff it up. I did save right before this, but I can save again. I can save again. Hi, lizard. I'll go save again with all my preparations. <laughs> I can say it again with all my preparation. Boop, 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 boop. How are you doing, lizard? All right, let's go in there. Okay, saving my progress. I do like that saving is with a phone. Okay. I thought I lost like all my saves for a second and was about to freak out, even though I'm in the game and it would be fine. <laughs> I was about to freak out. I was like, why isn't it loading? I wonder who she calls to record her progress. That's a good question. I'd also save over that say No, we're gonna keep it there. That's gonna be there to remind me of my mistakes, okay? I need that there to remind me always of my, my mistake. <laughs> it's part of my playthrough. It will, it will live forever in infamy, all right? We need it there. A reminder, exactly, it is a reminder. Okay, we have saved. But yeah, I don't remember which one you select first. I thought I had it down before and I'm kind of afraid of messing it up. So like, I don't wanna do that, right? No. I'm scared. <laughs> I'm so scared. I don't wanna do it wrong. I'm so scared, I'm so scared. Um, okay. But if you select this one first, wait, am I doing this right? No, I have to transfer it to the other gun. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We're doing it to this gun. We're taking the attack stats from this gun. Okay. This is so intimidating. Oh my goodness. All right, all right, all right, all right. You'll be okay, I just saved. 
Which tool would I like to use? I want to use the tool, right? Not the super tool. Oh, wait, no. Wait, what did I do? What I do? Am I doing it wrong? Do I click this one? Y'all, I'm scared. <laughs> I'm so intimidated by this weapon tool system. I just know I'm going to mess, mess it up. Like, I just know that I'm going to fuck it up. You are pulling from the stats of the gun you want. Oh, okay, wait. So, I have to select... So I do that first? You want to pull off the, the G23. Okay, so I pull this. Right? I'm hoping I'm doing this right, and I'm so afraid. You've got this, you can do it. If it doesn't work out, just reload the save. True. True. Yes, okay. And then I use this, and the G23 will be lost. Uh, yeah. We did it, kids! We did it! I made it through. I made it through. Success. All right. Now we have to take, um, now... <laughs> Now we have to take the, uh, what's it called? The first command from PPK, right? So in that case, I grab this. And then I pick this. And I grab this. And I have to use the super tool. I think I have to use the super tool. Because then I just take it, but I don't get rid of the gun, right? Or should I use just a regular tool? Do I still need the PPK or do I not use the PPK? That's, I think, the important question. Do I use a tool or do I use a super tool for that? I'm not entirely sure. <laughs> I'm like, wait, I don't know what's better in that instance. Do I want to keep it or do I not want to keep it? Oh, actually, I could use a super tool and then take the stats. Oh, okay. I'll do that then. We'll be moved. Is this okay? Okay. We're going to make this gun so strong. And then I will never use another, <laughs> another gun <laughs> ever. Okay. Um, there's a bit of strategy involved with upgrading. It definitely feels like it. Hi, Gem. You just woke up at 5 a.m. Good morning. Welcome in. I hope you're doing well. Okay. Parameter will be moved and PPK will be lost. Okay. Nice. All right. We did it. We did it. We made it through. We have a really nice gun now. Um, I can unequip the club. <laughs> it is truly scary to use the tools. It really is, especially when you don't understand how it all works. Now that I understand how it all works, I feel like I could do this playthrough so much better. Um, Cause before I was just kind of blindly doing it and like thinking I was upgrading stuff, but I don't think I really was. <laughs> but this is a good gun now. I think we can, we can destroy everything in our path. Time to save, hell yeah, Plume. I'm on it. Never give up. Maybe just in case, make a new save over your soft lock. <laughs> I, I could actually, or I could, should I, should I save over my soft lock or should I save down here? I'll save over the soft lock. Goodbye, my terrible memories. Goodbye, terrible memories. I do not miss you. We are free. We are young. We are free. You're looking respectfully. Thank you, clock. How are you today? Can we get a shout out for clock, please? How's your Sunday going? Now the slot is a symbol of success and victory. It is. You're gonna remain respectfully quiet. Thank you, B. I appreciate all the help though. The tool stuff I definitely needed help with. So thank you all for like explaining it to me and helping me figure out like the best way to do it. Cause honestly, it stressed me out. I was avoiding it this whole time because I was so stressed out. <laughs> like it gave me so much anxiety to do it. I was like, I don't wanna, I don't wanna mess it up. I already messed up one gun. Okay.
I think we were still looking for guns in the sewers too, right? Like, I haven't found out all of the guns in there. You just got home from a job today and here to relax. Oh, I hope work was okay. Welcome home. Please enjoy your Sunday. Please relax. Get that self-care in. Ow. I just stood in place because I thought she was going to shoot again. That's me being dumb. Ow. I should probably dodge more, but I'm a risk taker. Yeah, I don't think I found the shotgun, so we'll look for that. Let's see what we can find. Stream is going good though, Clock. I think we finally have like a really good uh, weapon. I do have a fence plus two, that is correct. Should I just put that on this gun? I also have the PE plus one. Yeah, I think we should just put it on this gun, mayhaps. Or I could save it for the shotgun, I guess. But this seems pretty solid. Because then I'll be doing, like, a lot of damage. A lot of damage, damage. It goes up by two. That's pretty solid. Time to shoot up all this stuff that was giving you crap. True. I'm gonna just do it. I think this will be, like, the gun that I use till the end. It was good. You worked at your local game store. Wait, Clock, that's so cool. I still have to check out the retro game store here. Um, like, near here with Sean. I really want to, like, see what they have. Were you just, like, working, like, uh... There is, like, a normal, like, job? Or was there, like, a special event going on? I'd use them on my main. Will do, Plume. I definitely want to kick some ass. Okay, let's see where... I think we need the M870 is what we need. That's the gun that I haven't had. Because I have the M203, but I don't have the M870. There's supposed to be, like, a number of items in here, but I feel like I did not find them all. Like, looking at this map, I definitely did not find them all at all. I'm glad that everybody is doing good. No, not the bats! Please, I'm cosplaying Morgan. They should not be doing me like this. What type of gun is the M870? I think it's a shotgun? Please don't ask. I don't know. <laughs> Please don't ask. I don't know. Okay, that bat's dead. I can barely see where it's facing, but we got this. <laughs> the camera is against me. It's a shotgun. M80, A70 isn't needed, though it has burst and you can't transfer anymore. Oh yeah, I won't be able to transfer. Maybe we can just get it for the lulls. Normal job, the store owners were at Anime North, so they were short staffed, so you asked if you could help them. That's really sweet of you to ask though, Clock. That's awesome. I'm glad that you were able to help. The camera is wild. It is a bit intense. Hi, David. How are you? I'm wondering. I feel like it says it should be here, but it's definitely not here. I'm going to just go over one. Wait. Wow. It's right here. I can't transfer anymore, but at least we have the gun. At least we have the gun. So then, hmm. I don't know where these other things are. They have like a few things listed and I'm kind of curious. Uh, hmm. They have like a range plus one. Oh, but these are all further down. So I have to progress. I have to progress. True, thank you. Thank you for the true, David. How's your Sunday going? The bats just, when they're in these tiny hallways, they're kind of rude. Actually? Okay. You know? You know, that was not nice. That was not nice. That was a little mean. Good thing I have more cure deed. Let me out! 
Oh no, I had to reload. I'm dumb. Okay, bat etiquette completely lacking. This game, no! I walked right into it. Okay, that's all me. That's all my fault. You know, I'm, I'm to blame there. I can't even blame the game because that's truly all my fault. <laughs> At least I'm looking very strong to do. Oh my God. I, oh, I think I can outrun it and I definitely can't. I definitely can't. Yeah, that's what I thought, Bat. That's what I thought. One day I'll be good at this game, I swear. That day is not today, but one day. <laughs> Just you wait. <laughs> I swear to God. I can't remember if there's armor at this point that can prevent blindness. I don't know, but honestly, I feel like it's not like a huge deal. I probably shouldn't use that, but I'm also gonna try to remember to reload. Oh, I wonder, I don't know if I should put that on this or if I might find something better. Like part of me is wondering if I'll find something better than this, but I'm not sure. At least the enemies are pretty kind and drop the right cures a lot. That's true. They at least do that. I'm gonna just put it on there for the sake of fearing up, like clearing up some inventory space. Can't tell if it's supposed to be, there's nothing in here. I don't think there's anything in here. This is the test of do I remember the way back or not? Nah? That's better than your best armor. I think, I can't remember where I found that. But yeah, I think I'm gonna use this armor forever. All right, we made it. Let's go back up the stairs and then we're gonna fight these bats on this narrow pathway. They really put these bats in here to test my patience, I think. <laughs> Genuinely. Can't they see that I'm Morgan? Don't they wanna be my friend? Clock, what armor were you using? You went to the warehouse? I didn't go there at first, so maybe that's where. I went to the warehouse again, but not inside. I only went to like the gate. Um, because both Plume and Bee mentioned that there are items that you can get right at the gate without even going inside. So that was worth it to me. Oh, you can go down that way? What's down that way? Maybe I should save first. <laughs> maybe I should save first, you know? Maybe I should, maybe I should save. A house you can't find, it's a warehouse. Well said. I kind of wish the second game was more like the first. Bums me out that they made it action-y. I feel like Resident Evil has that on lock. We didn't need another, another one of those. You know? Like, Resident Evil has it down pat. We could have had more Parasite Eve-like games that are unforgiving, but great. Okay, we'll just overwrite this one. Save often and always. Yeah, I. This that is the definite motto of this. Some kind of spectra armor. It was not a great choice to bank heavy into. Oh, I'm sorry. Well, we have DMC and we're gonna get FF16. Yeah, but those aren't like Parasite Eve. You're telling me Dante is like Ayaya? No way. Absolutely not. Square Enix always chasing trends. I guess. But I mean, I think Final Fantasy 16 is gonna be like its whole own beastie. He definitely goes Ayaya though, mayhaps. Honestly, I think the best part B is that I named her Ayaya and all of us in chat collectively had this moment where we were like, oh my God, that's what B's emote is. <laughs> like, like, it was just this collective aha moment. We were all just like, oh my god. Am I fighting a banana? What is this? Alligator? Holy shit. 
Interior crocodile alligator. Oh my god, it shoots a beam. What the fuck? That was pretty metal. Wait, why'd I shoot that one? That was my bad. I'm sorry. You thought they were huge roaches? What in the shit? Oh. They don't have as much, much health as I thought. Okay. Whew. Gator use hyper beam? It's like a Pokemon. Nice. I leveled up! Let's go! And I got BP! <gasps> Look at the items I got. I ride a Chevrolet movie theater. Well said, thank you for finishing that for me. Yeah, Moku, we were talking about Final Fantasy 16. I'm really excited for that. Okay, we're just gonna make my main weapon so OP that no one can mess with me. That's what we're gonna do, okay? We're gonna, we're gonna put this on here. We're gonna put this on this. I'm gonna be so OP. No one can mess with me, it's true. We got this. <laughs> Thank you, Agaia, for finishing it. Wait, there's an item over here. I should use my BP, but I don't know on what. Oh, I got another tool. Is there anything maybe hidden in this corner? Probably not, but you, it doesn't hurt to, I, <laughs> she's off the screen. <laughs> it doesn't hurt to check, right? It doesn't hurt. All right, let's see. Should I increase my weapon or should I do like active time? What's like the best thing to put points into? This is asking for a genuine opinion because I, I have just kind of been throwing it into random spots. So I am curious to know. Parasite Eve 2 wasn't going to be a Parasite Eve title in the start and only became one halfway through development. A lot of the people who worked on it also worked on the first Resident Evil. So it just kind of ended up that way. That's really sad, honestly. I mean, I get why if you were working on Resident Evil, you would want um, you would want it to be like similar to that. But I really like this. You did item capacity a lot, but because you hated storage, I'm gonna do I think active time. Because when you put it into active time, does it just make it go faster? Does it make it like load faster? I'm assuming that's what it does. But yeah, I'll do that. I upgraded my item capacity a few times, but I don't know if I need it anymore. Since I did like all of that upgrade stuff, I feel like I freed up a lot of inventory space. And I think going back to the NYPD like headquarters helped me. I believe so. I guess we're gonna find out. Let's go, Ayaya. I miss Eve. It's been so long since I've seen her and her tentacle. <laughs> Eve, please come home. I miss you. You miss my sister? Eve? My sister is named Megan. Can I go through here? No, that's not a door. That's a pipe! Oh my god, goodbye. Eve cosplay when? I think I would do better at cosplaying uh, Aya. Aya Brea? Cause she's blonde and all I'd have to do is put my hair up. Eve cosplay. I think B did an Eve cosplay, right? Or maybe I'm wrong, could be wrong. I know uh, B did cosplay from this game though, but I, I think I would want to do Aya. Cause I could just wear the dress and do her hair and all that stuff. They pulled a Capcom. What do you mean by they pulled a Capcom? Hi freakish. How are you doing? All right, where do I go now? <laughs> where do I go? How about Eve makeup cosplay? I could try. I would have to look at like a close up of her face. I don't think the pixels do her justice. Um, okay, the save point. I think the red dot is for a save point, right? Red dots and it's save points. So that's where I was. And this is, oh shit. Of course. Why would it be anything other than bats? You know what I'm saying? I am now. 
please, no more bats. The space is so tiny. I'm gonna get hit by this for sure. Where are they? They're so far away, yet so close to me. My depth perception is not for this man. I have like the worst depth perception in the world. I even confused like my eye doctor. <laughs> you didn't even know you could get ENC here? You can apparently. Making a game and then slipping a different, slapping a different name in development. Oh, okay. I think that happens with a lot of gaming companies. If you can dodge a wrench, you can dodge a bat. Um, we'll see if that's possible. I don't know. Of the four friends I've seen in this cosplay. Oh, thank you, Freakish. That's very sweet. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. I'm doing good though. I'm having a pretty chill day. I don't know if I'm supposed to go down that way. I thought I was supposed to go down that way, but it doesn't look like I can. Can I, can I walk across this? The water is too high to cross. Okay, so I've got to do something with the water. Oh, thank you, Savage. Y'all are going to make me, like... Oh, <laughs> thank y'all so much. That means so much to me. Thank you, guys. Do I have to do something with this, maybe? I... C oh, yeah. It is this. The master power is off. Turn it on. Pump one. But thank you guys, I appreciate that a lot. Cause considering I only just started cosplaying like two years ago, I do feel like I've improved a lot within those two years, but obviously I have a long way to go. There are a lot of cosplays I would like to redo that I started with um, on stream. Like I would really like to redo my Bowsette that I did. I think it would be really nice to like give her another shot and like actually try her hair um, without using my own hair. I think that would be fun to like do it with a wig. Um, but thank you guys for always supporting me with like all of my cosplay stuff and all my stream stuff. It really, it really means a lot and it's always nice to hear how much you like it. So thanks. RE4 development is amazing because technically three games were made out of it. That's pretty cool. I didn't know that. I've never played Resident Evil 4, but I plan to play that in October. Yeah, we are having fun. Sean is trying to sleep right now. I don't think he's successfully doing it a lot. There's not enough power? What if I do pump two? I think I might have messed up. I think I was not supposed to do that. Maybe that was a bad decision. Maybe I should not have done that. Um, I don't know what that was. I feel like I should have done it, but also I should not have done it. It was a little scary. We're gonna save in the third slot just in case I fucked it up. <laughs> just in case you were supposed to do that in like an order or something and I did it wrong. Every other horror game has copied the heck out of it two cents. What horror games were, like, inspired by Resident Evil 4 and, like, took stuff from Resident Evil 4? Because now I'm just curious since I've never played it. I feel like I need to know. Hold on. How did I get out? Did I go this way? No. <laughs> did I go out this door? Yes. <laughs> I was like, what did I even do? Okay. That is now blocked. The water is still too high. Okay. That didn't affect the water at all. Noted. I, what did I do wrong here? You think Resident Evil 4 inspired the whole over your shoulder thing? Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to do here. Let's see. To exit the level. No, I don't need that. I'm definitely not anywhere close to exiting the level, but I do need to figure out how to get across. I'm missing something. I'm 100% missing something. No, I don't want to drop an item in there. What 
What if I turn it off? Will that work? Fuck him up! Hell yeah! See, I have I can go big brain sometimes. I'll do my best, David. Right now, I'm just kind of making my way downtown. <laughs> but I'll do my best. I'll do my best. All right, let's go in here. Good timing. <laughs> Perfect timing. I fucked up that water. I showed it who's boss. All right, where the heck... Why does this game have so many good bops? What the heck? What's that? Nothing. I, I feel like I should turn this up. I feel like this is not loud enough. Like, that's so good! Good timing, the only thing you wish this game had a, is more music. I can understand that. This game has really good music, and when it does have, like, upbeat songs like this, it's just way too nice. Uh, okay, we're gonna use that on this. It is a banger, I agree. Okay. Yeah, this is getting pretty good. Active time recharge is slower. I wish I could move that off. If I could move that off, that would be better. How are you doing, Chad? What's up? Can we get a shout out for Chad, please? I have to request this song on Chad's next, like, Saturday stream. But I don't know. Let's see. I think there's supposed to be something else in, like, here potentially, but... I'm not 100% certain. Can I maybe go forward this way? I will. No, I can't go back this way. How are you doing, Chad? How's your Sunday? We got Chad fans up in here. This definitely is a good representation of the New York subway, though. Like, I've seen these chairs, like, at, uh, Port Authority's, like, subway stations. Absolutely. I'm doing good! I got a lot of help with, like, the tool upgrading stuff, so I'm feeling a bit more confident in this game now. Um, we're making our way through. I think, if I remember correctly, people said I should be level 30. Before I, like, do the end game stuff. Range plus one, hell yeah. Put it on that. They actually did their NYC homework. They did a really good job at making this look like New York. They nailed the look and feel of NYC, and that's cool. Someone that has never seen it. They nailed it as somebody who's like lived there and had to like commute through like different parts of New York. It's really cool that they tried to make it as accurate as possible. Like, I think it's neat that they they didn't just like do the stereotypical of like this is what New York looks like, but they actually like it looks like they did their research and realize, like, this is how it should be. I love it. It does have over 45 songs. That's more than most horror games or even RPGs. I just want them to play more music when I'm walking around. I think that's why it feels like there's not as much, is because there's a lot of moments in the game where you don't have music playing. And it would be cool if they had it play. It says there's a Medicine 3 in here, and I don't know where. We got the whole squad in here. The team went to New York for the game. That's good. That's like um, for Gen 5 in Pokemon. They also went to New York. <laughs> south? Okay. I gotta go south. Thank you, B. <laughs> I would have been here. It's in the top corner. Okay, wait. Hold on. I'll find it. Oh, there it is. Literally right in this shadow circle. Noted. Okay, let's save really quick. I thought you got that? No, B. My, my observation stat is negative 10. I miss things that are like right in front of my face. <laughs> I want the character to be over level 33. Okay, sorry I had to look for a sec, but at least what game slash show is this cosplay from? This is from Darkstalkers. This is Morgan from Darkstalkers. 
I really do love Morgan a lot though. Wait, is this something over here or no? No, it's just a light. Perception level zero, it's true. I, my depth perception is so bad, honestly. Um, hmm. I think, I have to go maybe on the other side. I'm not sure, hold on. Cause this is the, this is gonna be like my exit, like where I have to like use the gate key. Yeah, I need a key. So let's see, there's a lot of stuff that's not easily seen. That's what I'm learning. It's reminding me a lot of like old school platformers and stuff where you kind of want to not immediately go forward. You want to go back and make sure that there's not stuff there. Can I like jump down on this train track or no? No. How do I? Hmm. Hello, KJD. How are you? My issue is mostly how many spots are totally devout of music like in the web. Yeah, I think that's, that's exactly how it feels. Like a lot of people never catch that room in Chinatown. It does feel like it's very easily missable if you're not like a person who wants to explore a ton. And I feel like if you're used to like old school JRPGs, you should explore often and like talk to everybody, but I'm terrible at that myself, so. Is that a mole? Ah! Oh, I should have run to the right. That's my bad. Um, the mole is now underground. A little scary. No! The darkness has claimed me. It's okay, I have a lot of these. Do I have the fighting collection? I do not, but I would really like it. I was hoping it would shoot at me, but it's not. So hopefully I can just get rid of it. Are you gonna shoot at me? Woo, that was close. <laughs> I'm like, hello? All right. Let's get, oh, ow! That was not cool. like kezu arms that are like stretchy they keep giving me a lot of cures i do not have the fighting collection though i would really like it kjd does it have like online capabilities like can you play with friends because that would make it even better honestly hmm. i'm wondering if i should use like my medicine it does okay then i might have to pick that up because i really want to play dark stalkers really bad but that is what this character is from, for the person who asked. I think it was Handy Tips. Um, highly recommend it. I love the Darkstalkers fighting game. I think it's one of the best ones. Thank you for the follow, by the way. I do have anonymous follows on, just because I don't like calling people out of lurk. But if you do want to introduce yourself, please feel free. If you'd rather stay lurking, that's totally okay, too. You're okay with it sometimes, but um, not all the time. That's just how I felt about it. I think... I can understand where Plume's coming from, but I do think if you're like exploring a long area that doesn't have music, it can tend to feel like empty after a while. Maybe if it had like more ominous sounds like while you were exploring, that would kind of give more of that like feel, but it's an old game, so you know, it is what it is. Need to get the collection too, but no money. Relatable Plume, relatable. You have a Darkstalker poster in your room behind me, it's always in view. Who's your favorite Darkstalkers character? Hi, Uni. How are you? I don't really want to use my PE right now. Like, I know it recharges, but I don't want to use it. I feel like I should just use one of my medicines. But I only have, like, four of them. I'm just gonna go with what my gut tells me not to do, and hopefully it just recharges <laughs> with enough time. How are you doing? Thank you, Uni. You're so sweet. I appreciate that. How is your Sunday going? Oh, what's here? Is this a boss? Oh, shit!
I'm scared. I'm so scared. Yeah, you hate this fight? I am not excited. I am not excited. I'm not excited. What is Gene heal? Use PE to slowly recover HP. Um, okay. Okay. Uh... Let's cast that. Ow! You jerk! Oh, okay. That wasn't so bad. <laughs> okay, I'm poisoned, so I'm gonna need to use Cure P. I have a Cure P. We're good, we're good. Darkness? Oh no, I'm so boned. Oh my god. Why does the laser apply darkness? Hi, Dop. Welcome. I should have probably gotten the poison off first, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. What in the heck? This boss is like the status king. What the hell? Hell no! Wait, no. Can I attack more than one target? No, I can't. What are you doing? What the fuck? No, I whiffed. Oh, what the heck? Hold on. These things suck! I'm running out of bullets, actually. Wait. That is no good! And I'm poisoned, again. For the first time, I'm actually running out of ammo, which is not, not good. Wait, are... Th no! I think I can still... Hold on. I need to heal. Oh my god. I mean, I hate a lot of fights. I speedrun this, so we have a very weird relationship with this game. Honestly, you are valid. I feel like speedrunners have a very different relationship with the games that they speedrun, so that's honestly truly valid. I think I want to be in the middle, maybe? Oh my god! The poison, why? Okay. again. I'm doing great! Okay. Validation. That's all I need. Get me away from this. You are stinky. Oh no, it's out of my range. That's a bummer. Okay, do I like or love boba tea? I really love boba tea. I actually kind of have a problem. <laughs> Ow. Maybe? No, it's gonna be out of my range. Fuck! This last one's gonna be a pain in my ass, isn't it? Please. Please! I'm begging. Don't use med four though, save that. I'll try. No, it moved away! Oh, we did it. We did it. <laughs> we did it, thank you, Savage. Thank you, Clock. But yeah, I love boba tea. I like Thai milk tea, I like taro tea, I like green tea milk tea. Ugh, it's an addiction. It is, Scotty, it's so good. Thank y'all for the claps, I appreciate y'all. Oh, and I got ammo, and I got a gun. Okay, cool. 
You're drinking the same water? We're in this together. We're all in this together. Okay, so I can't, I don't want to use med four. I think using this was actually not so bad. Um, let me make sure I reload my gun. Oh, I would love to go back and save, but I'm scared. Hi, Raven, how are you? Was that actually a boss fight or was that just like a random fight? Genuinely curious. <laughs> Genuinely curious. Thank you for the well done. This water is good. This water is good. That was a boss fight, okay. So should I just go back and save? You can tell by the music. That's what I thought, but I was honestly second guessing myself. I was like, wait, do you ever gaslight yourself into being like, hmm, maybe that's not a boss. Maybe, <laughs> maybe that's not a boss. Even though the music sounds like every boss that I've fought, maybe it's not a boss, you know? Maybe it's not. Ohio, big fan of this game and seeing you call the character Aya is great. Thank you, Dop. I appreciate that. I'm sorry that I read that forever ago. I don't know if you're still here, but thank you so much. Um, this game has been really interesting so far. Um, and I couldn't resist naming her Aya. Yeah. Yoko Shimamura handles the whole soundtrack by herself, and honestly, you'd rather have quality over quantity, which is what I feel she gave. And that's fair, Plume. I think it just would have been cool if she had the opportunity to do more, you know? Um, but let's see. So I wonder. That gives me some faith that maybe I won't get attacked by something random. What? What is this? Game has been an experience, I'll tell you that much. <gasps> oh no! I just stepped on his face. <laughs> I'm sorry, sir! The slime's going towards... Goobert, what are you doing? Goobert. I can't believe that Goobert is taking over the museum. He probably liked it. He doesn't, he doesn't exist anymore. Insert disc two! Wait, but I didn't get to save. You smell that? It smells like little bitch in here. <laughs> but I didn't get to save. How does that work? I should have gone back and saved. I don't know how that works on the PSTV. Insert disc two. I'll be okay. Okay. But what do I do? What do I do? Insert disc two. How nostalgic. I've never... I've never had to do that. I've never had to do that on the PSTV. This is the first time. Um, you hold the home button. Thank you, clock! Clock is coming through for me. I'm like, how do I do that? Push the PS button. I have to hold it, right? Right, I have to hold it. There we go. Where do I do it? Do I reset it? Do I like restart the game or do I just do like setting? Switch discs! Ha, look at that. Okay, whew, whew, we did it kids, we did it. <laughs> we loaded disc two, okay, thank you, thank you guys. I'm like, this is my first time playing a game on my PSTV. You had to hear that one. <laughs> Goobert for NYC Mayor, thank you. Activity Goobert would love to. Mode. Luke, hello. Luke, thank you so much for the sub for four years. Holy shit, Luke. Holy shit, thank you so much. Y'all, Luke has been one of my longest supporters ever and is also a streamer. Please, please check out Luke. Thank you for shouting out Luke. Thank you so, so much. Don't restart, I won't restart. I won't restart. This cosplay has- I kind of love that it has the disc too. Thank you for your existence. I'm love, Jong's love. Thank you, thank you, Luke. I'm glad that everybody loves this cosplay. I'm gonna have to like wear it again for sure. A streamer. You do stream. You also do karaoke. Thank you, Chief. I do be winning. I do be thriving. We are all thriving on this Sunday. How are you doing, Sean? You're okay? Okay. Alright, let's see what we gotta do now. I think... Is there something maybe to, like, the right? I feel like there might be something to the right that I don't really want to miss. Would this go elsewhere or no? Will this go to like the same place? 
Yeah, this goes to the same place. Let's see. Four years, hold up. Yeah, I've technically been streaming for about uh, four years, but the first two years were off and on. Um, so I wasn't really streaming like that much from 2018 through 2019. I kind of just streamed whenever I could. Um, and because I had like a two hour commute to work and a two hour commute back, I just didn't really stream as often. I didn't really start streaming a lot until 2020. Ooh. What did I just pick up on this side then? Hold on. What did I get? I didn't even read it. I went into autopilot. I got the bee protector. It might've been like just a tool. It might be just a tool. Okay. Do I have extra tools now? Tool, 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 tool. Okay, I've got a lot of tools. <laughs> I've got a lot of tools. I think it might be worth it to do, to get rid of like that, um, the active time being slower on my armor. Now that I know how to do it, but let's save first, just in case, because you never know. I might fuck it up. I'm glad that I came over here to check. He did the same as you, pretty much. It's, it's hard. Like, I feel like streaming consistently is great. And once you get into like a good flow of it and you know what works for you is so good. But until you do, it can be really tough. Also, you tagged me in Discord. You found some cute little figurines. Oh, I'll have to look. I'll have to look. I scare you sometimes? Wait, why do I scare you? I am just a nerd. I'm literally just a, just a nerd. Because you're a people? Oh, okay, fair. Fair point. People are scary. I don't know if people are as scary as like the body horror monsters in this game. I tell you what. Well, I saved my progress, yes. I think we made some good progress in the game today though. Like at first we didn't really do too much other than get like my weapon and stuff, but I, I think that's good enough. Like it's very helpful. They're just trying to live their best undead life, but what if they're not dead? Hear me out. What if they're not dead? They're just mutated. Oh, but I think I can still do it though, right? Hold on. Like this is still very much better, but I need to get that active time thing off. I would need a super tool though. And I only have tools, which sucks. Is there a way to know like if I'm gonna... <laughs> get a super tool in a bit or did I already like miss all of them what does the bee protector have resist stiffness that would actually be kind of nice but If I take a skill from another equipment piece, can I put it over this skill to get rid of it? Is that possible? I'm gonna try. I don't know if it's possible, but I'm gonna try. I'm gonna, I'm on the longest day now, so any progress is good. Good point, good point. Like, what if I pull from this? There are no empty slots. Okay, so no, you can't. You can't. You're coming up on the best part in the game and you got yourself set up good for it. You say it was good progress. I just want to remove that skill. I want to remove it so bad. Sag, okay. I thought I understood it. I didn't. I would need a super tool, I think, to remove it. That's kind of a bummer, but it is what it is. I just don't know where a super tool would be. I feel like I might have missed some that I could have found in like earlier areas. Ooh, it's nighttime now. Okay, I gotta go to the museum. Maybe I should put some stuff in storage first though. 
trying to get into the habit of like going back here first. Or get another mod slot? I do not even know how I would get another mod slot. Would I be able to like modify my equipment to have an extra slot? Day five and six are the highlights. Interesting. All right, midnight is closing in, you're off to bed. Have a good night, monster. Thank you for hanging out as usual. I appreciate you. Please get your rest. Mod permits if you had any. Oh, I don't have any mod permits. Unfortunately, I do not have any. But I will be storing some items. Or trading cards. I do have a trading card. How do you use the trading card? Zeronian. Can I, like, use it by just talking to this dude? I do have one trading card. Literally just the one. Um, I guess I could store, I don't think it's gonna allow me to store anything actually. Not in equipment anyway. Cause it seems like I have to have like one of each thing. I could put the gate key in here though. With this room, why is there no music? I don't know. Maybe since it was only her working on it, it was just a lot to compose. Look at all those keys. I do have a lot of keys. I have a good amount of space though, so that's pretty good. I also have a lot of tools. Maybe I should like put some tools in here. Really bothers me that there's no music here. This would be the perfect spot for music. Like the perfect spot for music in here. Like a quick, cool little like shop theme. Here, we'll, we'll play our own. I got this. Don't worry. I got this, y'all. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Hi, Josh. How are you? <laughs> this works. This is perfect. I don't know what y'all mean. Given how much time I was in here, I'm glad it doesn't. You get, you'd have gotten sick of the song. I'm not sick of it though. I do have a trading card. How do I do it? Rare T card. I don't really have one yet. I have no idea how I use this. How are you doing, Josh? How's your day going? Ba -da -da. Tune up. Okay. Do I have to talk to him specifically? Maybe I do. That trading card allowed me to do it without talking to him, but we'll see. Burm, 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 burm. Light but tough armor. It doesn't let me. You've been through this game about 20 times. It's okay, we got our own theme now. It's all good. Or do I maybe not have to have it, like I can't have it equipped? Tune up card, then select the equipment. Oh, okay. I think this theme is great, guys. I don't know. What equipment do you want to tune up? Add slot. Ooh, okay. But I still need a super tool. I still need a super tool to get rid of the um, attack, like active time event thingy. It's growing on me. It's a good song. You are in here for three hours? Three hours? My goodness. Go hard. Okay. We are gonna pull this. Yeah, I just wanna get rid of that active, like uh, my ac action bar being slow. But I need a super tool for that, definitely. Okay, we can turn off my shop music now. I'm sorry, y'all, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. You shot a cute game, Junior.
What game did you do that with? I'm so I'm so intrigued. Bruh, I didn't mean that. Okay, but you gotta admit, Junior, it was a little funny. It was kind of funny. The post-game area doesn't mess around. There's a post-game area? Goddamn. Okay. Thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. I do have anonymous follows on just because I don't like calling people out of lurk. If you would like to introduce yourself, please feel free. If you'd rather stay lurking, it's totally okay. Okay. I think I finally have the hang of this. Thank you, Riku. How are you? Hello, Prickly Peppy. Nice to meet you. How are you? How are you doing, Josh? How are you doing, Riku? How are your days? Can we get a shout out for Riku, please? Bum, 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 bum. Very nice to meet you, Peppy. All right, let's go to the museum and just see what's happening. Contemplating whether to wake up for work. Aren't you awake right now? I say don't go to work. Work is not worth it. Everybody quit. Everybody quit your work. We're all in this together. Well, I say post game, but I mean that EX playthrough you can do after you beat it once. Oh, okay. <laughs> Her legs just phased through the door. Quit? Okay. Yeah, butter. We gotta quit. We're all quitting. Everybody quit your jobs. <laughs> say no more. I got y'all. Who that? Who's that? Who's there? Okay. You need money to buy more games. Okay, wait, actually, that's a really good point. Work literally just finished uh, that for today. Oh, congrats on finishing work, Josh. That's awesome. I'm sorry they had to work on a Sunday, though. I always feel bad for people who have to work on Sundays. I don't mind working on Saturday because Saturday is like my chill, my chill work day. Um, but I, I feel for the Sunday because Sunday is like my favorite day of the week. Monday is also one of my favorite days of the week, which feels weird, but it's partially because I don't work Mondays. Side so clock is right. Clock is very much right. It's warehouse, so it alternates. Ah, okay. How many animals are hiding? Bro, I don't know. What? I didn't count. I don't know. I'm just going to guess. Was I wrong? Okay, let's try this again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Looks like nine. But you know, I might not be able to count. Woo! I did it, I'm smart. I can count to nine. You need money to buy more manga? That is a good point. I don't know if I'm going the right way or the wrong way. I like to go the wrong way first. Because what if I find cool items? But if it sends me like, oh. Someone obviously doesn't want me to get through this area. What was the nutritional source of the first organism that lived 3.9 billion years ago? Um, I'm gonna say this but it's probably wrong. I don't remember. Self-conducted photosynthesis, maybe that. Nope. <laughs> While this scorpion is just here, I'm doing a quiz. What? Hey, I didn't get anything from this quiz. They're all wrong? Wait. Okay, let's do this. Let's fight this guy. That's a lot of damage! Hold on. Holy shit. Hope I'm not too late. You're not late, mercenary! How are you doing today? Oh! It missed. Okay. How are you doing, mercenary? Oh my god, we're here? Yes, we're here, but I don't know what that means. I'm scared, but I don't know what that means. Okay, poison. Ow! 
You would think I would get poisoned from that, but I don't. I'll take it. What is that? Holy shit, being forced to update your PC? Wait, update to what? What do you have to update to? Did I ever try the warehouse? No, I have not tried the warehouse again. We did go back to get the items that are right in front of the gate, but I did not try it again. You only get two tries. Oh, thank you, Plume, for clarifying. I'm just dumb. So this is the area where you want to level up to 33 or 35 and farm items. Okay. That I can do. Well, that's a bummer. Let's just reload my save really quick. Windows update. Oh, okay. That's not so bad. Windows update is not so bad. That range? Yeah, that's scary range. But it looks like it can miss if it goes, like, over your head. I should have reloaded. Why do these look like robots? They kind of look like robots. I know that they're not, but they kind of do. They kind of look like... Ow. Okay, I need to heal really bad. I kind of need to heal pretty bad. The key should be in the area before those two spiders you kept getting trapped by. Oh. I don't know if I'm going to go back there in this playthrough right now. Maybe in the future I will, but we'll see. I don't know. It just seems very... Oh, this removes all negative static effects. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Status effects. I said static. I don't know why I said static. It's been ages since you played this. I think I would like to play this again. Now that I have a better understanding of, like, the weapons and such, it would be cool to try it again. 69 damage? Okay. They kind of look like they're bopping. They probably are. It's a good tune. It do be a good, a good tune. They be dinos, so welcome to Jurassic Park. We've got dinosaurs. Let's fucking go. How the hell did those dinosaurs get in here? I gotta love it. I'm a fan. Okay, let's use this for now, and then um, I'll reload. I almost wonder if it's worth it to put like all my guns in storage that I possibly can. But I don't know. Heal 3 is pretty strong here, by the way. It may be worth doing it once in a while in combat. I will if I feel like I need to. Yeah, definitely. Because I don't think I'm going to need to use haste Activate that often unless it's a mode. boss. Banshee! Thank you for the sub for seven months! Holy shit. Thank you so much, Banshee. How are you doing today? Can we get a shout out for Banshee, please? I love her. Guys, please check out Banshee. Please check out her Twitter, check out her Twitch. She does amazing art. She's absolutely fantastic. But thank you so much, Banshee. I appreciate you. The warehouse can be done at any time in day five before said point. Ah, okay. I don't know what the said um, point is, but thank you. Cosplay. How's your weekend, Banshee? Hold on, I gotta get closer. Whoa, or not, they came at me. They're like little jumping friends. Little froggos, little lizards? I don't know. They live a long time. Or I'm just hitting the wrong one all the time. My god. I need a lot of ammo. Where are you going? Oh, thank you for attacking me. Whoop, they do be a little shite. They do be a little shit. It's after a point in the museum that you haven't gotten to yet. Oh, okay. Good to know. Oh, I got a lot of junk, but not really what I needed. I kind of need more ammo than junk. Anything, like, underneath here? I'm doing good, Banshee. I'm just chilling. I'm very happy that I have the day off today and that I can just vibe with everybody. Oh wait, I did not see what that is. Looks like a new gun maybe? Yeah, it looks like it has to be a new gun. Oh, it's M203-4. What does it have? Add frost effect to bullets, okay. That's pretty neat. 
It's a grenade launcher. Cool. Cool, cool. But yeah, I'm just chilling. I'm in the area with bones of them all over. So why wouldn't there be dinos? Well, you know, because dinos have been extinct. I think, I think she's got reason to question it. The mitochondria creates ATP, adenosine triphosphate within the cell. How much energy is this equivalent to? Bro, I don't know. Hell if I know. Hell if I know! I'm totally not Google it, Googling it, but the first thing that pops up is the mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. <laughs> Creates. The answer is right there, it would seem. No. I'm stupid. Biology was never, never my good subject. Listen. I'm totally Googling it. I can't use my brain right now, okay? Um, Google did not help me at all. It just gave me a lot of research papers on... <laughs> It gave me a lot of research papers. I got it. I got it. I figured it out. I'm a genius. No, I'm just kidding. But I, I did, I did get the answer. Do a poll. I appreciate that. Next time we got a quiz, we'll, we'll do it. Ain't nobody got time for that. I definitely don't. I'm not smart enough for it, and I'd get it wrong. And I didn't know you only get two tries. So I can't have that happen to me. Dinos. This is. Not the Dino Crisis that I thought I would play, but it's close enough. Anybody in here a fan of Dino Crisis? Ow. Dang, this Dino is living forever. Ow. Ow. Yeah, Regina rocks. I've never played Dino Crisis. It's kind of intimidating for me, honestly, because it has like the clunky like tank controls, and I feel like I would suck. Who are you aiming at? Oh, it's a good in. Maybe I'll play it one day. I'm not sure. You want to play it at some point, but Dino Crisis looks so cool. It does seem very cool. I can't get through here. Okay. Ominous. Is there a box here? Hell yeah. Increases defense by one. That's pretty poggers. Let's grab that. I'm probably going to be using this armor for like a long time, right? Defense plus one. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. There we go. What's down this hallway? Should I heal up to full? Maybe I should. Let's just heal up to full. Regina rocks. Is that the main character? I somehow doubt relying on the collective intel intelligence of this chat is a poor idea. I think it's a great idea. You guys have never done me wrong. Like, remember when we named Celeste Thought and we named Sabin Simp and Edgar Himbo? I think that was a great time. I think we did a great job. There's just a rock in front of that exit. Is there nothing in here for me to do? It was a hit. It was a smack hit. That armor is very cool, honestly. The only thing that sucks is the, ac the action bar recharging slow. That's literally it. It doesn't look like there's anything I can do in this room. But it seems kind of weird that it would be here if there's nothing for me to do. Maybe I have to do something later? That's all I can think of. Hold up. Well, see, that's the thing, Clock, is you. we named them before we knew their personalities very well. So it just kind of happened that way. 
And it was too late to go back and change Edgar's name, you know? Thank you, King Fun Boots. How are you today? You kind of know them all from all your playthroughs. Or you're just a genius, Plume. Don't sell yourself short. Tell everybody that you're the smartest. That you are the most intelligent. But yeah, how's your weekend, King Fun Boots? All right, let's let's see. I guess we'll backtrack. But I feel like I'm supposed to go through that area. It is actually even funnier considering that Savin is a himbo and Edgar is a mega simp. Yeah, no, not this. Oh, it's like a little chameleon. Oh, you're so cute. You're a little shit, but you're so cute. I like you. Even though you're a shitter. And you're probably just gonna give me junk. Or medicine, I'll take that, I'll take the medicine. No, you're dumb, you're not dumb, Plume. Hush. Yeah, we realized a little late that Sabin is actually the himbo and Edgar is the mega simp. It do be like that sometimes though, you know? You make mistakes. Oh, so you can go in here. Okay. Ah! I'm scared. Why does a reptile have medicine? It wants to cure me. Oh, shit. You know what? Maybe... Hold on. Actually, here... Maybe I do want to use this. I don't know who this dinosaur is going for. It's definitely not me. Ow. Why am I running into that dino? That was a bad mistake. <laughs> I like ran into the dinosaur. Okay, I'm gonna stay away from the other one. That was a mistake, but it's okay. There's one left and it's doing a dance. Do your little dance. They need to heal up too. If you've got a lady running around shooting at them, that's a fair point. I didn't really think about it like that. Okay, nice. Level up. And I got some ammo. Okay, that's good. I'm always worried that I'm gonna run out of ammo and then I don't. So that's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. Guys, by the way, don't worry if you get lost in here. You did very, very hard. I'm okay with getting lost. It's so cute, bang. It has to go. It has to go. But, um, okay, I'm gonna save. I feel like I should just save because I've leveled up. I've made some good progress. And I also think it'll be good to level grind here, like Plume said. Like, I think getting lost will honestly do me, do me well. Because I don't want to progress too far and then not be able to level grind anymore. Who, what? I can go in this exhibit? Oh, wait, there was a box down there. That's so cool, you can't even see it. That was awesome. Okay, I appreciate that a lot. That's gonna come in handy, that medicine four. Okay. Oh no. Ah! Aaron Yeager on the beat. Let's get ready to rumble. Josh, thank you for the 1,000 biddies. Oh my God. Thank you for the 1,000 biddies. I appreciate the Aaron Yeager on the beat. Thank you, thank you. Oh my God, that scared the crap out of me. That, that truly scared the crap out of me. I should have reloaded before coming in here, for sure. Okay, let's heal. That'll help. Thank you so much, Josh. You didn't have to do that. That's so kind, thank you. Wait, I don't wanna shoot that. I wanna shoot this. 
Just because I think the dino is going to be more annoying to deal with than the chameleons. Like, the chameleons do a good amount of damage, it's true, but like... Oh no, I had to reload! Haste is also way too useful. I should have been using that in the hospital for sure. Okay, nice. They also just miss and do nothing a lot. It's true! Josh, thank you for the 50 bitties! Thank you so much! That's very kind of you. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Okay, there's a box behind this skull. Hi, Z! How have you been? What have you been up to? I do be cosplaying Morgan today. I hope I did her justice. I need to fix the bangs, though. Can I look in here? Or no? No, I can't. Hey, this was very useful. You ended up spanning it a ton across your playthrough. It makes a big difference for me here, mostly because, um... Oh, my armor affects my action bar, which kind of sucks. My good, my, my weekend, my good, my good has been weekend. My weekend has been good. My weekend's been really chill, honestly. Uh, I cannot complain. My weekend technically did just start today, but it's been a really good time. Hello, Super Ninbo. Welcome. Thank you so much for liking my Morgan. I appreciate that so much. Thank you, thank you. It's my first time playing this game, so I'm a little intimidated by it. It's been a little scary. <laughs> It's honestly been very scary. <laughs> Not in like the horror sense, but in the stressing me out sense. I do like Aya a lot though. Okay, there's a lot of dinosaurs in this tiny little space. Not sure if I'm a fan of that, but it's okay. We got the haste. I'm happy that I get to play this game that a lot of people love though. At first, I wasn't sure how I was going to be able to play it, and then the Vita comes in clutch, as always. It's also feeding that dino crisis need. Ah. It's a very stressful game to learn. You just played it for the first time last Halloween. It seems like a great Halloween game, or a great uh, Grimbus game, I guess. It has a big learning curve, I would say. Like, the... the the weapon and equipment, like, upgrades, I feel like you can easily mess that up. So it helped me to have people that I can, like, ask questions and make sure I do things right. <laughs> it's just very intimidating. Nevi! Nevi! Oh my god, Nevi, thank you for the raid! Oh my god, Nevi, thank you so much! I also messed up weapons, so don't worry, Ninbo. I also... I accidentally got rid of weapons that I did not mean to get rid of. Um, so I... I understand. It's a fun game, though. I would like to play it again, because I feel like I could do so much better. Also, hello everybody from Nevi's Raid! Hi, Slamma again! Hi, Daft! Hi, Antimony! Hi, MQ! Hi, Kyle! Hi, Snowmans! Hi, Ollie! Hello, Glacy. I think I'm saying that correctly, but please let me know if I'm not. Please let me know if I'm ever mispronouncing names, by the way. I never want to pronounce uh, names incorrectly. Uh, thank you so much, <laughs> Nevi. I appreciate it. Everybody from Nevi Stream, hi. My name is Elise. Um, I am a variety streamer. I stream mostly JRPGs, but I do also um, play a lot of action games, such as Soulsborns and Soulslikes and Monster Hunter. Um, I also play a lot of visual novels like I the Somnium Files and Danganronpa. I do a lot of cosplay streams. As you can probably tell, I am cosplaying Morrigan today. Um, I do also chat a lot with my communities. So if you like very chatty streamers, I tend to get off topic and talk to my community a lot. It's part of the vibe here. Um, if that's your vibe, hello, welcome, enjoy your stay. Thank you for raiding me, Nevi. How was stream? What were you playing? Did we get a shout out for Nevi already? I'm gonna shout out Nevi again. I love Nevi. Nevi understands my Crisis Core love, which reminds me, Activate since Nevi raided mode. me, I have to show. Nevi, thank you! <laughs> thank you for the sub for two months. You're so sweet. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Oh my gosh, we're in combat mode now. Ba -na 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 -na. 
Crisis Core fans. I know Nevi is also a Crisis Core fan and a Zach Fair fan, so I have to show. I can definitely play it again. I've heard that you can like replay it almost like a new game plus type thing. So I'm excited to try that. Um, but there's my Zach figure, Nevi, that I managed to snag for really inexpensive. He's really beautiful. Hi, Kay, how are you? And then I also added something new to my collection because I, I got it also cheaper than I was expecting to. Um, look at it. Look at it. This is new. Look at it. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. I'm so happy. Wait, I'm not Lord Raptor or am I? Or am I? I'll never tell. But no, no. That's a beautiful PSP. It's really gorgeous. It's really gorgeous. Time to play Portable 3rd. I probably could, but I don't own it. Isn't it pretty? Isn't it so pretty? I'm good. How am I in life? I am doing really well. I am chilling today. I am vibing. I'm trying to get through Parasite Eve, but we're level grinding right now, so we're having a good time. Also, I just want to say I love your Link emote. The, the Link think makes me happy. That makes me very happy. At least I think that's supposed to be Link. If it's not, I'm sorry, but it looks like Link and I love it. <laughs> I think it is, but if it's not, I, I, still, I still love it. Thank you, Nevi. I knew you would appreciate it. I knew you would appreciate it. But I had to show, because it just came this week and I freaked out a little bit. I was really excited. I love the design. It came with, um, it came with headphones that have them too, but I don't I know if they work. Thank you for the boss weapons. Can we get shout outs for, um, I think we need to shout out Snowmans. I think we need to shout out Snowmans. I don't think we shouted out Snowmans yet, but we do need to. How's everybody doing though from Nevi stream? How are we all doing? It's his slash our original design. It's really cute. I love that design. And I also love how, like, in Nintendo Power, so many people were, would draw, like, that Link design, and it's always so precious. I've always wanted to cosplay it. I'm a huge Legend of Zelda fan. I know it doesn't seem like it, because I don't have as much Legend of Zelda stuff as my, like, Final Fantasy Crisis Core stuff. Um, but Legend of Zelda is actually the, the series that got me into gaming when I was a kid. Uh, my dad introduced me to gaming via Ocarina of Time and A Link to the Past. <laughs> So I really love the Zelda series. I've played them all. I love them so much uh, Majora's Mask is my favorite I'm a big fan. What's my cosplay of? I am technically Cosplaying Morgan from Darkstalkers. I am Morgan from Darkstalkers today. You're one of my new favorite people Are you I, I mean I can tell that you're a Legend of Zelda fan You're a Parasite E fan and you like my cosplay. So I automatically love you already <laughs> New friends, let's go. Oh, I just hit my bat wing. How's Parasite Eve? It's intense. Um, I will say this, I think it would help to make sure like before you upgrade any weapons, just make sure that you understand like the mechanics and everything like that. Um, it can be very unforgiving, um, but it's really good. I like this game a lot. I just think it's, it's important to have like more than one save in case you mess up. Um, just so that you can reload again if you end up like messing up like a weapon upgrade or if you end up going somewhere where you shouldn't, like I did. <laughs> just helps to have the extra precautions in place. But other than that, I think the game is really good. Darkstalkers is best fighting game. I love it. Darkstalkers and Skullgirls I think have been my favorite, for sure. Those ones are my favorite ones. P is the best game just because of how Aya yeets her date. Yeah, she's just like, you suck. You're stinky. I think I need to go to storage. Maybe I'll discard one of these. Actually, let's discard two of these. I don't know if I'm gonna need the, the curing darkness. Let's get this. It's a tool! Okay, we should probably go store some stuff. Let's go store some stuff. We have a lot of tools, actually. So, I don't think I'm gonna need all of them in here, though. Let's go back in this way. I think I've been liking Parasite Eve more than like the early Resident Evil games I've played. Whoa! Aaron Yeager on the beat. Let's get ready to rumble. That always scares me so much. Oh my god, Josh, thank you. 
for the 2,000 biddies. I appreciate, actually 2,700 biddies, I should say. Thank you so much, Josh. I appreciate that. Thank you for saying that. That's really kind. Thank you. Thank you for the hype, Nevi. Also, everybody from Nevi stream, if you need to get food, if you need to recharge and just rest, please feel free to do it. There's never any pressure. We love lurkers here. Um, but I hope you're all having a great weekend. Hi, Boba. How are you? Um, but yeah, I think I'm gonna save and I'm gonna go store some stuff. This is very true. Dude was lame. Hold on. Which dude? He needed it to be sure he did. He kind of sucked. Her date was kind of stinky. She looked so good too in her like black dress and everything. She looked so good. And that date was terrible. His reaction to everything going down was lackluster too. <laughs> But yeah, I really appreciate it, Josh. Thank you so much. You need dinner suggestions? What should you eat? What are your options, Nevi? What options do we have for food? What do we got? I'm gonna explore a little bit. Put some stuff in the NYPD storage. I mean, I'm always gonna recommend like sushi. <laughs> Because that's how I am. I love poke bowls very much. But also, like, I really like Chinese food. I love that. If you mean, like, cooking for yourself, that's a whole different ballgame. I don't know. You're getting a tattoo on the 18th of August? What tattoo? What are you getting tattooed? No, oh, no, definitely eating out. Okay, what do we got? What are our options to order from? We got this. You're definitely thinking Chinese. Chinese just hits the spot. Chinese like takeout hits the spot every time. You can never go wrong with it. It's always yummy. So far, every character in this game has been really cool, minus the date that you have in the beginning. Don't know why that is, but he's just very stinky. He's definitely not a good person. Ooh, hold on. Nice. You can sort stuff. That's awesome. Okay. Let's give him the junk. That should clear up a good amount of my inventory. It's been very long since we had Chinese. I can't remember when I last had Chinese either. I really need to eat it again. Maybe if Sean's down for it, we could watch Stranger Things and eat Chinese food together. If he's up for it. I don't know if he will be. Okay. That actually helped me way more. <laughs> Let's go. Let's get out. A face of Rengoku would set your heart ablaze next to it, but that's all you'll say. The tattoo itself can be a spoiler. That is totally valid. Thank you for not spoiling. Um, I actually have a Rengoku cosplay um, because I just want to say 420 is legal in California, okay? Um, so I took a picture as Rengoku with a, with, with a thing. And I, want, I captioned it, set your heart ablaze it. I thought it was pretty funny, but I haven't, po like, I haven't really posted it anywhere outside my Discord, because I'm too chicken. But I thought it was pretty hilarious, okay? You gotta be up for Stranger Things and Chinese food. This is just reality. I love Stranger Things so much, and I'm just really happy that Sean is liking it. Um, but it doesn't that just sound like the perfect combo, like Stranger Things and Chinese food? It just sounds so good. Like it's like such a great combination. A good show with like good food. You can't you can't mess it up. You will get Chinese. Let's go. What do you get for your Chinese food order? You haven't had Chinese food in a minute. It's time. Let's all just order Chinese. Nevi has inspired us all to get Chinese food. I did finish the last season. Yes. Um Sean has not watched all of it yet. Like we started at the very beginning. Um, two days ago? Um, so we're watching through that now. And it's been really fun re-watching the first season. I think the fourth season was my favorite. Part one, anyway. Uh, season four, part one is like my favorite season that they've done so far. I really liked it. I thought it was so good. And actually like pretty scary at first. When you get it, you'll post it in Discord. Thank you, Josh. I know we'd all like to see it. It would be really cool. And that sounds like a perfect meal to start Stranger Things with. It does! I don't know. I think it'd just be really nice. 
Thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. I hope you enjoy your stay. I do have anonymous follows on just because I don't like calling people out of lurk. If you do want to introduce yourself, please feel free. If you'd rather stay lurking, it's totally okay. We love lurkers. Season four is also your fave. It was just the best. Like, I don't get me wrong. Season three was also really nice because I felt like they got back to their roots with it. Season two is my least favorite season, even though I really love Will. Um... But yeah, if I had to rank it, I think right now for me, season four, part one, um, season one, season like three and season four, part two are like tied, and then season two. Season two had that episode. It just, I don't know. It just doesn't hit quite the same. You live out in nowhere, you can't get Chinese food. We're gonna hand deliver Chinese food to Plume. We'll do it as a joint effort, all of us together. I know Will popped off, like uh, Will's actor, Noah Schnapp, like popped off in season two and did a great job. I just wish, I wish I liked season two more. It just kind of felt like a mess. And I think with season three, they found their footing again, which was nice. Season four is just impeccable. I love it. I definitely cried during the last episode, though. <laughs> I cried a lot. I cried a lot. Get away from me, Dino! Even with my increased movement speed. Actually. Yeah, I should have just shot at it. The town that's close by here is just Silent Hill. And that's not scary? I would be terrified. What? Okay, we got some medicine and some ammo. This is definitely just me grinding the stream, <laughs> but I hope you all enjoy it. It's locked. Okay, so I can't go in there. I'm definitely gonna be lost in here for a bit, and that is okay. I know this is not the same as living near Silent Hill, obviously. But I know where they filmed, like, the Disturbia house. I've seen that. That is all I can say that I've seen that's, like, spooky. I also know where the Matilda house is from the old movie Matilda. I think they've changed it from what it looked like in Matilda, though. I hate to say it. I don't think it looks like the Matilda house anymore. But I know where those houses are. Better than it is. Come here, dino. This dino is kicking my butt. Hello. Thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. Hope you enjoy your stay here. Uh, let's see. I think we got this. I think we'll be okay. Ow! Don't be mean to me. Wow. I'm being bullied. <laughs> this do be a bop. That's one thing, Snowman's, that I can say is that this game has like some of the best tracks I've ever heard. Definitely makes me want to play more of the games that the composers worked on. Thank you, Ragnats. How are you? Welcome in. Okay, I got some junk. All right, let me heal up again, because heal three is definitely worth it in here. How's your weekend going, Ragnats? I'm sorry for anybody who has to work tomorrow. I hope work goes by fast and that it's not terrible for any of y'all. Okay, wonder how close I am to level 30. Let's see. You're happy to see me in good spirits? Thank you. It's been a really good weekend and a pretty chill day. I can't complain. I am fairly happy. The music in this game is just like unlike anything around. It's very well done. It's unique, and but it's like, I don't know how to explain it. It just makes me happy. I like it a lot. Until I get to hear the ending theme, I'm pretty hyped to hear it. I wish I had more of like the dinos and less of these chameleons. Is that rude? They're just kind of obnoxious. I feel mean, but they are kind of obnoxious. You think your blood sugar is spiking a bit? Take care of yourself. 
I'm not familiar with how to like take care of blood sugar, but please make sure you do everything that you may need to do. Parasite powers have evolved. Free race. Whoa. Wait, what's that? My parasite powers have evolved? Pre-raise. Revives when HP reaches zero. Oh, so that's like re-raise or whatever in Final Fantasy where you can like cast it on yourself and then if you die, you can, you automatically revive. That's really cool. That is how you felt. <laughs> Fair. Weekend was good. Took your kids to mini golf and cupcakes. Mini golf is always fun. I don't care what anyone says. Mini golf is fun as hell. I have such a blast whenever I go mini golfing. I don't care what anyone says. That stuff's so much fun. You don't have any official things to do, but you got an under desk cycler, so you figured doing some reps on that would help burn. Oh, those things, like the under desk bikes and stuff, always seem so neat. Like in all honesty, they seem pretty useful, but I've never had one myself. Thank you, Wolf Lord. Can we get a shout out for Wolf Lord, please? Thank you so much. I'm really happy people like this cosplay because I was like super self-conscious about it. Um, so I'm really happy that everyone likes it. <laughs> and that people support my mini golf, my mini golf dreams. Thanks y'all. Thank you for the follow. I hope you enjoy your stay. I have anonymous follows on just cause I don't like calling people out of lurk. Um, but if you do want to introduce yourself, we'd love to get to know you. If you'd rather, you know, stay lurking, it's totally okay. Good morning, who's the key? Welcome in. Nice to meet you too. How are you doing today? Let me tell you a thing. What thing? What do you want to tell me? You don't need to feel self self conscious about anything. Thank you, Luke. I appreciate it. You're lurking. Thank you for the lurk, Ocean. I'm glad that you like the cosplay too. Thank you so much. Y'all are so sweet to me. Thank y'all. Love mini golf, not normal golf. I don't mind normal golf, but it is very difficult. It is not an easy game. I gotta say. Like, I feel like it looks deceptively easy, but it's not. Working on the Blue Bagatas, Lena. Good luck. I hope it's going well. Oh, I can shoot the dino. I still have a shot left. That's how bad that was going. Okay. It's gonna hit me and I'm gonna have to heal. But that's okay. I got the haste off. Wait, not medic. Honestly, you used to act like a hard ass who didn't give a fuck about anything, but I still cared a ton. I am just very... I don't know how to explain it. Like, I'm a very self-conscious person. I don't have, like, the most confidence. I wish I did, but I can be really hard on myself. Thank you for the stack box. We have to do more stack boxes. We were so close to having 69 stack boxes and we failed. Lately, you fully embrace the I don't give a fuck mentality and it's so opening and freeing. I feel like for the most part, I don't really give a fuck. But when it comes to like me being self-conscious, I definitely do. But that's just me being hard on myself. I'm my own biggest critic. What is Stackbox? Stackbox is basically our own like chat Jenga. So if you ever want to like play Jenga in chat, you just do Stackbox. And there's always a small percentage chance that you're going to cause all of the boxes to fall over. But will you or won't you? You'll never know. Bye, Nox. Enjoy your trip. Please enjoy your trip. I hope it's fun. Aya runs like you doing your nightmares. Yeah, she's not very urgent, but then again, this game came out a long time ago. So maybe it was just hard for them to program her running faster. I don't know to stop you from feeling self-conscious. Thank you, Clock. That's very sweet of you all. All right. But okay, beautiful people. Let me, let me save. We got to level 30. So we have three more levels to go and then we can um, progress more in the museum. Um, but I think this is where going to end stream today. I've been streaming for about three hours and 40 minutes, um, which is pretty good. I feel like we made a lot of progress. I'm going to be playing this game again on Tuesday. Um, so we'll be playing this game pretty soon again. 
Um, just because I feel like we're close to the end, but also I'm enjoying it a lot and I want to play it more. <laughs> um, I will be posting the schedule tomorrow. Um, again, I will be streaming Tuesday, Saturday, Sunday, just for my mental health and because work has been so stressful lately. Um, for the time being, I will be doing three streams a week instead of four streams a week. Um, so yeah, we'll be playing Parasite Eve on Tuesday at 5.30 p.m. Um, and we'll be playing Monster Hunter Rise on Switch on Saturday. And then we'll be playing I, the Somnium Files Nirvana Initiative on Sunday. Um, but yeah, I'm very excited. Fuck, I hate how snarky you am. Why do you hate it? You can be snarky. Thank you for hanging with me, all of you. Thank you, Chief. Thank you for thinking that cosplay is great. That means a lot. Hi, Specky. Hello. Let me shout out Spectrum really quick. I feel like I missed a lot of shout outs today, so I apologize if I did. Um, but you're all wonderful. You're all amazing. Y'all know I love y'all. Wish you could have been in here more, but love the stream. Thank you, Josh. I appreciate that. Y'all are always so sweet to me. Thank you. You're never late. There is no such thing as being late. You're all amazing. You come on time. The whole point of the stream is that you can come and go as you please. I never want people to feel like they have to, they have to be here um, like all the time. I don't want you guys to feel like it's required. I appreciate it whenever y'all are able to come by, even if it's for like a minute or two. No, you! Oh, you're welcome, Nevi. I love you so much. I relate to you so much. And it's just very nice to have like another friend who's into all the crazy stuff that I'm into. So thank you so much, Nevi, for being my friend. <laughs> I hope you enjoy your Chinese food. I'm gonna see if Sean wants to eat Chinese food. Um, and we're probably gonna watch some Stranger Things. But yeah, I made a lot of new friends today and that's awesome. Me and Goobert had a really good time with you all. And I'm happy to have made a lot of new friends. <laughs> And I'm always happy to have hung out with all of you. Y'all make my day every day. Um, no, TY for being you. I'm giddy. I'm so giddy. Y'all make me happy. Thank y'all so much. Um, let's see who shall we raid today. Let me see who's streaming. Chinese food and stranger things. I think that's the plan. I think that will be the plan. Um, let's pass the love over. Oh, you know what? In the spirit of spooky games, let's pass the love over to Jill. Jill is playing Madison. I don't know what Madison is. But it do be a spooky game. And we were playing kind of a spooky game. So that feels appropriate. Let's pass the love over to Jill. We all know I love Jill. It's entertaining so far. Let's do it. Let's do it. If you want to join in my humble Discord where I post extra cosplay photos and stuff like that, um, please feel free. All of my emotes are available there, including ones that haven't been uploaded um, to Twitch. Um, it's where we hang out, where all the chaos continues when I'm not streaming. So feel free to hang out with all of us there. We're really cool people, even if we are chaotic gremlins. Um, if you want to follow me on any of my socials, I do have a YouTube, a TikTok, um, an Instagram, and a Twitter. Mostly I post pictures and I meme a lot, but if you like that, you will love those places. It's never required, always appreciated. Um, if you have my emotes, you can spam this little cutie. If you don't have my emotes, you can spam this. And if you're just in a silly, goofy mood, you can spam the dab. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys on Tuesday. Thank you all for spending your weekend with me. It always means a lot. You guys could pick to be like anywhere and you guys choose to hang out with me. And I always appreciate that. <laughs> I always, always do. So thank y'all so much. Um, thank you to everybody who gave biddies, who subbed, who raided today. Cosmic Saki, Shady, um, I think I, uh, Nevi, Nevi duh, Nevi duh. Oh my God, I almost forgot Nevi. That would have been so mean. I love you, Nevi. <laughs> we had a few raiders today, but thank you guys so much. I appreciate you all. Thank you for the continued support. You're all amazing. Stay cool, stay cute, enjoy the new week. Bye, bye, bye. I love you guys. Bye.